Hi, I'm Jack, and I like video games and puzzles and other stuff. And I'm Katie, and I also like, well, I like puzzles and stuff. Yay! <laughs> so, it is Dungeons & Dragons Night here on our channel, so I know we have a lot of new followers, a lot of new people watching us, so thank you for coming out, first of all. Mm -hmm. I've been playing a lot of Sky Factory lately, and I do appreciate you guys coming to watch me do that. But Tuesday nights, we play Dungeons & Dragons with our friends, uh, so if you want to hang around and watch us, uh, we're, we're going to do our best. Hey, Cage, thank you very much. A year of love. Oh, Cage, thank you so much. Mm -hmm. uh, we do our best to keep an eye on the uh, chat and the alerts and stuff, um, but we're really focused on the game, so we'll try to to type to you, but we're not going to be able to talk as much because we have a lot of other people talking. So, mm -hmm. hey, uh, so this is credited on the two days, two hours. I'm finished my program. The one, is, hey, congratulations. Uh, who is that? That's uh, God, I lost you. Felicrux, hey, Felicrux, congratulations, man. That's super kick ass. So, anyway, all right. So, um, also tonight, we're doing something special where if you donate to Katie's Extra Life page, which I realize now I forgot to give Casavara a link. But I'm sure Kasavar can figure it out. He's, he's a smart person. Kasavar, Christian is hard. can figure it out. If you donate uh, $10 or more to Katie's Extra Life page, you can influence our game. You can actually influence the game. You can actually give us advantage rolls and stuff like that. And uh, we'll do some other stuff, like maybe name characters at a certain rate or whatever, like a certain amount. But it's all Extra Life donations. It's not coming to us. It's all going to Extra Life. So that's pretty kick-ass. Of course, we still have bits open, too. So if you want to throw bits in there, great. But you don't have to. We love you. Anyway, all right. So we're going to go over and say hi to all our friends. So thank you for watching, everyone. Here we Yay. go. We're going to do this. All right. Do that. Unmute them. They can hear us right now. Hello. Oh, we can. All right. Hi, Hi, guys. All right. So I went through. I explained. I explained a little bit about the extra life donation thing, and I realized we never sent our mods the uh, link to Katie's uh, extra life donation page. So they're gonna sort that out. Oh, that's cool. I didn't even think about that. Damn. Now I gotta sort that shit out. <laughs> I don't know what's. I going on. I uh, I feel like I should. Um, I have no idea what's happening. What? I was not in the room when this happened. So, so uh, Eric and I were talking, and we were like, you know, for it'd be kind of cool. Like we have the thing where you can influence the game by like doing advantage rolls and uh, things like that. Like maybe even like name characters at some point. Like if someone donates like a hundred dollars, um, but instead of us making money off this, we should do like a charity thing. Okay. So, um, so if you donate to Extra Life, either our Extra Life or Eric's Extra Life, uh, you can actually influence the outcome of the game. So I think I think we set it at ten dollars per advantage roll. Or disadvantage yeah. roll, or something like that. So, and uh, you sh we should get an alert uh, if it pops up. So, yeah, cool. Well, that's pretty awesome. And we're using mine. Yeah, yeah, we're using yours. All right. Is that oh, okay? I see it on yeah. The, on the Divi Boots page. Yeah. I got to... nothing on Jack's page. There's like nothing. 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 Squat. Literally yeah, nothing. Sure. All right. So Ka Kasavara has a link right now uh, in the chat, and he'll post that. So if anyone's curious. Uh, we can't hear your friends. Turn them up. Oh, my Elgato's quiet. There you go. Let me fix that. Elgato! Oh, El there we Gato. go. Okay, what's Elgato? Remember, I wasn't there. You guys can't have all this inside <laughs> shit. What is an Elgato? Is that your mic? A cat? What? Is it like El El Guapo? Elgato's a, a capture device. Rick's dealing from uh, his own form of PTSD from not going to RTX. Yeah, not partying with That's us. That's true. Your reverse PTSD. <laughs> like, crap, I can do this. Just like, we all were just repeating what, what Jack was saying. It actually has... We... we I don't think it means anything to us. Oh, no? Okay. Well, y'all acted like it, so I don't know. <laughs> Damn. We act a fool. Eric, I got your throne on. some shade. Do you have me on throne? Yeah. Am I on throne cam? Oh, I love you it. You are on a throne. It really brings want, out the color in your eyes. I don't want to my love. I don't want to be that guy or play that character, but I forgot my laptop again. Feel the crooks. Thank you. Um, Wait, isn't it in your Katie house? forgot a laptop. Um, Do you want a I'll, cat? I'll be, guy, I'll, be, uh, I'll be right back. Oh, can you say, look at your cute feet clawing into your... Yep, it hurts. Check out my pants. They're Jack's pants. Katie has this thing where she's wearing all Those of my Those are amazing. My yeah, pants. rock it. Wow. You shake that. Is that, you is shake that shit from Saved by the Bell? <laughs> she's going to the max right now. Right? Shout out to if you remember <laughs> Saved by the Bell. I don't know how young this is. Who doesn't? Well, we do. Yeah, I guess. We just hide our age well. Holy shit. Well? Yeah. Well, some of us. Psst, that means check. Oh, uh, Fila Crux. All right. So uh, we have one extra life donation so far, but I, it hasn't popped up yet. So that's a good thing. We'll see. Well, this will be a okay. test. Mm -hmm. See how long it takes for it to pop up. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Felix. Yeah, yeah. Bits for Felix. or Felix Crux. Felix Crux. Felix Crux is awesome. <clears throat> that Crux. Get that Crux. And... Oh, yeah. It's been so long since we've played. I feel like this is the first time I've done it. Have I met you? <laughs> What's your name? Who are you? What? 
I'm Jack Patil. Wait, don't they is a uh, Helob? <laughs> oh, oh yeah, Jack. so here here is my dice box. Oh, yeah. What does oh, your dice two. box look Where's like? Mine? Mine, mine, mine looks like this. I threw can mine I say out. Co- can I say cocaine online? Or... Yes. Okay. Because so Jack and oh, breaking and Rick have a have a blue one. Katie and uh, hey Chad, this Eric is what you guys look like. That's what chat looks like on camera. Weird. Does that work? No. Can you see you? No. There's I didn't put any cards. dice in it, but let's see what happens when I put dice in it. <clears throat> oh man, here we go. This is it. This is a christening. It's Wait. lovely. The... Oh yeah, and I have a rad black oh, one. Yeah. I love mine. Yeah, let's get the black one. Oh shit, that fits right in there. It was cool. They they asked me when I was getting them made. I was there. We black one. They were like, uh, like, what do you want? Any special colors or anything? And I was like, oh, just if you just want to do a mix of like whatever, like whatever you guys think are the best. Like okay, and so they sent me like five a little bit different ones. So like mine's blue with uh, like silver and gold. So that's like silver and then it's gold trim. So cool. And I think yours is the reverse of that, Rick. Mine is blue with a silver trim and gold word. Yeah, so it's flipped. Oh. All right. So we're uh, I'm, I'm trying to see here if. So I see that Katie got a donation, but it hasn't popped up yet. So I can also look what? on my end. Streamlabs. The chair is broken. How did you have permission to connect my thing with your? I, I just logged into it. Oh, I just logged oh, into it. Oh, them passwords. What? What happened? We have LastPass. Somebody just posted your password on chat. <laughs> <laughs> Not again. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. It's That's Elgato sixty nine. Alerts enabled. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but the the E and the L is a three. <laughs> Obviously. Obviously. <laughs> oh, you know what? I wonder if I need to change my URL. Hang on a second. Um, should we do something about D and D? Oh, yeah. yeah Introduce talk- yourselves. How about, wait, how about somebody? Somebody should do the recap from two no, weeks. No, let's weeks do the recap ago. later. We'll do the recap next time. <laughs> next time on. Wait, the bar stuff happened, and you got a parrot, and I was things I was too drunk to do to do the recap, so someone else has to do it. Can we do plugs or like later? Yeah. Is that no, is that no. is hey, that, pl- is that cool of me to I, ask? I, I, I want you to plug away. Pl- plug your plug your plug. Can plug you with it. We're gonna do now. Are we going to jump into the recap or are we going to do intros? Do your intro and do your Who plug. are you, sir with Who the a beard? Hell are you? Let's just start. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> uh, I'm Rick. I play Burdick Ashrin, uh, Ranger from the Icewind Dale, here on Amateur eyes. Hour. I can see it in your smile. Um, this is it feels good to be sung to. Um, I just wanted to say I relaunched a reward tier on my Patreon, and now along yeah. with, and that's uh, www.patreon.com slash Rick Lacey. Um, I'm making a dark fantasy comic that's very D and D. That's going to be available free as I post it. Murder hobos. What's that? Is that aside from murder hobos? No, or? it is murder hobos. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, but that's getting a new. It's getting a rebranding next month. So stay oh, tuned cool. for a new title because I wasn't really feeling that one. But one dollar gets you a lot of behind the scenes production artwork. Two dollars gets you D and D five E supplements that I'm turning into D D five E supplements from my comic books. Like my characters are gonna be NPCs. I'm gonna write up some hooks, some environments, artifacts and stuff for my own games, along with a lot of original artwork that I'm doing. So and that's a two bucks. So I just wanted to plug yeah. that. Um, Plus even... everything featured in the dollar tier. Yeah, and you get everything in the dollar tier, which is all the behind the scenes artwork for my comic book. So awesome. yeah, thanks for letting me plug that. That's patreon.com slash Rick Lacey. That's the last time we ever do that. Yeah. No. So, Why? For, Never so again. For, for people who actually have no idea what <laughs> what you're talking about, you're you're yeah. doing a web comic. Oh, like what? What is Patreon and what am I making? What are you making? Yeah. So Patreon is like Kickstarter, mm-hmm. but it's a monthly pledge base where people get to tip the artist or the creator for certain rewards. I'm making a dark fantasy comic. Um, uh, about three adventures that face off against evil and their own moral choices. Um, and it's very akin to D&D. You'll see a lot of different monsters from games like Dungeons and & Dragons, environments, um, 
from Dungeons and Dragons. It's just this overall tone is very Dungeons and Dragons. Mm -hmm. And in a two dollar tier, everything that I'm making in the comic book, I'm kind of turning into D and D supplements. So spells, Ooh. characters, environments. Um, hopefully, to eventually just kind of make a catalog of supplements. Very cool. Yeah, I can I be in it? Yeah. If if wait in the book or in the Patreon, because it'll cost you one dollar to get in the Patreon. It'll be free to get in the book. <laughs> <laughs> the free no, one no, so much <laughs> all right so who's doing the recap oh does then everybody else want to do intros i just did mine i thought you were doing a plug oh well i did are we all too. doing an intro and a plug okay know. we, we can all do intros so and plugs we've okay. done this. Alyssa. hello <laughs> right it's awkward we don't know all right here we go all you're right doing great. hi my you're name is Alyssa. Hi, Alyssa. Hi. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, and I play a half elf monk named Rookie, and she has a pet spirate that's a pirate spider um, named Helob. He pretty much saves everything. And uh, she's a compulsive liar who is turning into a damn fear right now. Um, and uh, she's also a germaphobe, but because of the um, her, because of her experiences in Ravenloft, um, she's kind of changing very slowly into a different person and trying to work out what's going on. Yeah, internally. <laughs> yeah. What do you have to plug? Yeah, <laughs> yeah what do you have to plug? Um, I guess I could... So there's the C-Team yeah, <laughs> on okay. another D&D show. Yeah, so I run I run a show called The C Team, and that's every Thursday, 3.30 to 6.30 p.m. Pacific Time on twitch.tv slash hyperrpg. Okay. What a shit show that is. <laughs> I, was trying to, I, was trying to, I was trying to spin it so that every time you watch them, you have to watch us. <laughs> but yeah. there's no way of doing that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just sort of spamming C Team chat with, like, divvyloots.com. Calm. <laughs> <laughs> Do it. Uh, I'm just gonna go out and introduce myself for the game. Um, I'm Katie. I play Hyacinth, um, Osiridian. I'm a, a wood elf um, that was once attached to Archimedes, who will introduce himself shortly. Um, I have a donkey named Rhea, who I love. I have to draw the donkey, but I she knew at this point. What's that? I said, you guys got a zoo at this we point. We do huh? have quite the menagerie. Cats and dogs living the together. The menagerie. Uh, anyway. Menagerie. Uh, she is very woodsy in that she's very uh, diplomatic, um, connected to nature, and thinks that everything has a, a reason for being and a place in the world. Um, so she's not she's not trigger happy. She, she'd much rather try to make everybody happy then have to make the decision to uh, potentially end someone's existence on that plane of life so um i think that's oh she has a wand and a really cool castle somewhere but we haven't seen uh... man that's like a whole adventure waiting yeah to we haven't yeah. seen that that castle <laughs> right? yet um but she has just a, what she looks like a little bit she has really long uh copper hair that she's never cut um oh copper i'm gonna have to remember that <laughs> and uh copper skin and freckles um and she's tall and oh, that's, freckles that's i forgot the freckles you forgot the freckles the nine page email i sent you <laughs> <laughs> oh, god i should was, share that online it was so long There's so much reference there was so much reference <laughs> it was like it was like it was like getting a like a real paid client <laughs> yes, it really wait did jack send anything over no, Jack's the only one. I trust Jack's you. the only one out of everybody that's just been like cool, man. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, did Alyssa send something? Did yeah. I say anything? She had she had her critiques. <laughs> did were, I? Were, oh yeah, it was just about vaunting a pirate. Oh, oh, I sent him. Oh, a, he love was missing. Email. Wasn't much. I think you actually had more <laughs> critiques about my first rendition of high <laughs> than you did about your own character. Anyway, Listen, the point it is, was a deep Jack plunge. hasn't said anything. <laughs> Jack was. It was. <laughs> <laughs> we fixed it real quick. Oh, we did, did. We, have we showed the new artwork that I'm working on? Uh, you put it on Twitter. It's on Twitter. Why isn't Eric a floating orb? It really irks me. He needs to be a floating orb. Eric needs to be a floating orb. Fine. I could put him in there. I've got. I've got to put two wolves, a parrot, a donkey, a <laughs> spider, freckles. <laughs> <laughs> freckles. Done. 
So I am playing Archimedes, who is a uh, high elf uh, wizard, and uh, he's uh, been through a lot. Right now he's a little drunk. He's unconscious, or kind of drifting in and out of consciousness. But uh, at one point, uh, Hyacinth and Archimedes were tied together. Literally, they were they were, like they were attached. one person with two heads, and then they split into two, and they're back to their own selves again. And lots of fun with that. So uh, yeah, I have nothing. What, I have nothing to plug. What kind of what kind of uh, I'm I'm a lawful good. What what are you? Uh, I'm sort of a neutral, like n- neutral. I guess. I think you just said regular neutral. Yeah, maybe lawful. Was it lawful? Neutral. I don't think you. I think you're just neutral. I still believe it's in like good. the hardest alignment to play. Yeah, but I Jack likes like, animals more than people. No, no that's uh, why you're re- leaning neutral good. Yeah, I'll say right. neutral good. That's what I'm probably at. And uh, we've had we have we've had two donations already so far, and for some reason I'm not sure why oh, nice. um, why Sorry. it's not triggering on my thing. But we have we've had a ten dollar donation and a fifteen dollar donation. I'm just trying to figure this out. So if I look distracted, I'm trying to sort that out. Did you partner it in Streamlabs? Yes. That's weird. It should come up in your normal alert box. Yeah, I mean, here, I'll do a test donation. You can see. Yeah, see that? It worked right there. John! Way to go! You're the man, <laughs> John. A woman. So that works, but for some reason, it's not triggering. <laughs> some names just aren't gender neutral. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I feel like, okay, well, while Jack's doing that, does someone else want to do the recap? Do you Do you want me to do it? I kind of want, I kind of want Eric to do it. And- yeah. As, as, like, and also, like, re explain where we are. No, nope. I'll be your best friend. Why? Oh my gosh, I used to say that all the time. Hey, that's rad. What? You should say it more often again. It's the best. Rake, if you do it, I'll be your best friend. Fine. Yes. I hate this. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you're going to have to, you're going to have to fill in the blanks I'll, here. I'll help. Any of the place names. Uh-huh. Um, but we, long story short, we eventually got Fizzwigs. Fizzwigs? Fizzgig. Fizzgig, so close. Got his help to teleport us to the island of... Mm-hmm. What's it called? Mm-hmm. Spe- <coughs> Speculara. Oh, oh, yeah, right. <laughs> Speculara. Sepultura. Um, that's what, yeah, that's what we all usually go Is that with. how you... Is it Sepultura? Is that Sepultura? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> you, what? No. It, are you, anyway. are you are you joking, Rick? You're a little quiet. Sepultura is a Eric, metal band. You know. Yes, yeah, that's what I keep but the problem, trying to say. The problem is, I don't know if Rick's joking anymore because he thought he didn't know Katie was Australian. Wait, Katie's Australian? <laughs> yeah. So they say. No. Anyway, I'm trying to do a recap here. Sorry. Yeah, right. get your shit together. Rick. Um, so Come we on. got to the Isla de Muerte. Um, no, you didn't. No, we didn't. That's the other island we need to get to. We get to Seculera and um, immediately. Jack's off to the races, drunk by the time we get into the rum bar. Um, there, it's a little, it gets a little fuzzy. Um, we met a few people. We did a little dancing. Um, there was a game. A game was had, a game of dice, where we met a captain. Mm-hmm. Um, and we were trying to get his assistance because we needed a ship to get to the Isla de Muerte, where we're supposed to go find the other magical orb, similar to the one that zapped us to Ravenloft. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's a pearl, I believe. Yeah, is it a pearl? Yeah, just a little pearl. Mm-hmm. So from there, um, we set up. Uh, 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 what would you call it? For you, hire pirates. Is that the term? Is there a term for hiring pirates? Not press gang. That's kidnapping pirates. Shanghai oh. is kidnapping. Right. Shanghai? No. Uh, I thought we were just recruiting. Recruitment is a good word to use. We're commissioning just, our pirates. Boom, right down in the middle of the bar where we started to recruit pirates. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, and I think that's where we ended. Uh, we're in this rum bar. You you, you gave uh, Xavier as your name. I did because I don't know. I don't, I don't know really where we are and I don't trust everybody. And it's better that we have aliases. That's why I started calling Archimedes, Antonio Bandana. I don't know if the rest of you have. <laughs> I forget what and, mine was. And, drunk, and drunk Archimedes start, started calling you Xavier, too, from the floor. I don't know if you ever yeah, picked up on that. It's working. It's working, right? And also, and I also um, found out that the, pir- the parrot is the smartest character in the entire bar. Mm-hmm. Um, so now we have an accord. It's, a, it's like a rocky partnership. <laughs> um, <laughs> and, and 
that's where we're at. The captain's going to meet us next day with his ship and the crew that we've got, uh, mm-hmm. and off to the Isla de Gato. I would like Mark- to note that I did I find a complete pirate outfit? You got a sash and a hat. And a you hat. gambled for it. Oh, that's right. You know that it's that's going to be that's going to be a work in progress as we go. You can't get all the loot, all like your yeah. armor loot. In one location, That's you know, true. you know, you have to go to different locations. You're for right. Before it's the whole set. Wishful thinking over here. <laughs> <laughs> I think that did it leave anything out? No, I think that, no, that was good. Pretty much nailed it, man. Oh, I uh, I got left behind for a hot minute. What do you mean? You guys teleported oh, yeah. without me. I don't remember that. Oh, did we? Yeah. That doesn't sound like us. And then I, I think yeah. it was a different group. She I'm grabbed a, a a goblet of wine, right? Yes, and that's why I arrived super drunk. That's right. Or like <laughs> tipsy, then got super drunk. Yeah, blame it on the goblet. It was blame a fancy goblet. Goblet. Uh, Nobody else. I, 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 I mean, was great. I was. I was. Yeah. Okay. I was Thank dancing. You. I need that. <laughs> falling, falling. Blame All right, Eric, play us in. Rain. Sorry. Rain, rain. So you're in the port right now. We're in what, the does port? the port have a name? Did we wake up or is it morning? You're in a giant yeah, chair it's, now, it's, Eric. It's it's mo- oh yes, I love it. Because <laughs> I'm so tiny. What happened? You it is morning. You woke up, Archimedes. Your head is throbbing from the amount of booze that you managed to imbibe last evening. You don't even remember why uh Britic was marking names off in the in a book you realize that now there's a parrot with you which you don't remember how and or why it's there the parrot's looking at you so i, I woke up in the bar judging you no 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 that you're you're you you are up in your room and the parrot's in my room <laughs> yeah <laughs> great i'm like chester sleep somewhere else right. what's the parrot's <laughs> name again chester oh it is chester okay All right. Aw. What? At least that's what I was told. That's what he told me. It could be the somebody parrot? else. I gave him a wrong name. Was the it the parrot, parrot named the Chester? Pirate? The pirate was Maul. The, oh, the is the par- pirate in his room? No. The <laughs> What's the pa- parrot? The Who parrot? Runs? What's the yeah. parrot's I name? I thought the parrot's name is Chester. Chester. Yes. Uh, yes. And the I parrot see. is in Archimedes' room right now. Yes. Why okay. are you saying pirate? I wasn't Wait, a saying parrot. Was the parrot named after Byron? Because Byron was the Byron Penguin. Chester Cobblepot Obama the Third. Oh, that's right. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I think maybe Eric has a list of three NPC names. <laughs> he just goes back and forth. Yeah. That's it. Uh, I wake up and I look at the parrot and I say, "Who are you?" <laughs> hey, who are you? Wait, what do, do you I... mean? Who am I? Who are you? Can I hear the parrot talking, or was that? Fuck yeah, yeah. The parrot can talk to you. Are you talking to me? Are you talking to me? Holly, want a cracker? Fuck off. You must be friends with Britic. Yeah, he's good. I like that guy. All right. Where where am I? Where is everybody else? Do you know can you do you have cognitive thought or you just repeat things? No, I can tell you you were freaking bombed last night. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. You're lucky your friends are so nice and they let you uh, you know, brought you to the room, put you on the bed. Otherwise, I would have left you down there. But Look at how nice I am. I made sure you didn't choke on your own vomit. Well, thank you. Parrot. Yeah, you're darn right. Yeah. What? I mean, if I was choking on my own vomit, would you? I mean, you're pretty small. Yeah, I probably put my little foot on your face and then move it over. So, you know, rotate it, rotate it a little. Oh, okay. Well, all right. Well, uh, where, do you know where everyone oh, is? You, you can say you're welcome. Oh, thank, I'm okay with that. You're, you're yeah. welcome. Uh, you're, thank you. Um, you. Do you know yeah, where everyone is? Yeah. Probably in their other rooms. All right. Do I have my clothes on? <laughs> thank God you got your clothes uh, on. Yeah. And I, I'm just massaging my head and I walk out, out trying to find everybody yeah. else. That's not all you tried to massage last night. Well, Whoa. Whoa. I, that was internal. <laughs> Teen rated. Maybe you can read mine. Is Chester telepathic? Not yet. <laughs> Not yet. I feel like he's going to have stats. He's like a really vulgar bard. Yeah. Can I, and, as, and as I'm walking, I kind of pat Chester on the head. 
if you freaking do that to me one more time, I swear to God, I'm going to bite your kneecaps. <laughs> okay. Okay. You're a bird. And then I walk out. <laughs> and I, I start stumbling about trying to find everybody else. Okay. So you walk out of your room and you notice there are about five other doors down this hallway that um, you might want to try and see who's in if you, you would assume that that's where everybody else was staying all right do I, do I hear anyone rustling around and behind any door they're all silent is it is it morning i guess yeah it's morning time now all right do i do i hear any rustling you actually you don't hear any rustling from the doors but you hear rustling from the stairs that go down uh back down to the tavern oh, okay kind of like they're preparing the morning uh, meals all right. Well, uh, I kind of listen to here if, if I hear anything at the door, and if not, I go downstairs to go get some breakfast for myself. Hey, hey, you're gonna leave me behind? I'm coming with you. I need some sausage. All right. Is that okay? Sure. Do you do you like ride ride on people's shoulders, or do you fly yourself? What do you do? Hey, hey, hey! Don't tell me how I I'm about to do my business. All right. Okay. And flies up on your shoulder. Cool. And then I just walked out like, like my brain's still not processing everything. And it's just like, <laughs> it's the weirdest goddamn thing that's happening to me right now. And all I know is just, my eyes are hurting and everything is painful and my lips are super dry. <laughs> so I walk down, I walk down to the, uh, the tavern bar, to get some breakfast mm-hmm. or the tavern, get some breakfast. Yep. And there is actually a spread out on one of, you know, a, basically a giant circular table that you can kind of pick your own food for for your breakfast what is everybody else doing in their respective rooms what time of morning is it uh it's about 8 a.m early morning probably british probably up um Mm -hmm. at this point being a ranger he'll he'll rise early um and just downstairs nursing whatever hangover he might have um with whatever food is there and seeing go ahead you 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 walk downstairs. You see Archimedes kind of falling back and forth. You see Chester on his shoulder on his mm-hmm. shoulder, and you see him digging into a giant mound of food. I'm also like slowly like eating, and I'm slowly feeding some to Chester as well. well I figured I'd be, I'm down there. I figured I was down there as they were approaching. I was already downstairs, oh, okay. like kind of waiting waiting for that, and I'll wave him over. And uh, you found Chester. Oh, hey, I, I might have found him. Don't you say that. You didn't find me. Uh, You're your own parrot. <laughs> Damn right. I'm just, I, glad that, I'm just glad that both of you are still alive. That was a rowdy night last night. What, Brittick, what happened last night, man? You were exceptional. <laughs> yeah. Throwing knives, singing songs, dancing on tabletops. That, puking. Women. That's, yeah. Right, Chester? I was a woman? Yeah. What? No, yeah, you, you, you dogs. All I'm saying, weird guy. That's. But we have a crew. We have a crew. Yes. We got a ship. I hope so. Chester here actually might know more than I do. <laughs> really? Uh, how, rookie, how, how did rookie manage that? Rookie, what are you up to? I almost so, spit out my <laughs> coffee rum. <laughs> how how far away is the ship from the tavern? The tavern, it's probably a 10 minute walk. Okay. Um, so I'm, um, I think I woke up fairly early and, and I, I'm going to roam the streets and uh, look for, um, what, are the, what are those called? One of those, um, like, like a spyglass kind of sort of thing. Mm-hmm. Um, and, and I'm just going to kind of meander and, and people watch. Okay. Um, so yeah, is there, is there any trace of one? Yeah, you can uh, you can find mer- uh, merchants around. Um, there is one in particular that you see this jolly giant big man with a gut that's probably the size of mine, and <laughs> he's wearing uh, an apron, and he, he almost seems like a blacksmith, but he's working on very sophisticated items. Um, you see these what looks like almost like glasses that he's working on, but behind him on his shelves are all these different, um, you can see spy glasses, barometers, you can see star f- uh, finders, Ooh. Na- navigational tools. Okay. Brain so I'm going to lean over and I'm going to say, excuse me, sir. Excuse me. I'm looking for, 
Well, um, okay. This is one of my first times out on sea, uh, out on the sea, and I, oh. I'm not entirely sure exactly what I should what I should be carrying. Can you help me out? Well, yes, I think I can. And you see this man walk to his different shelves, and he starts to pull things off the shelves. You see him pulling a a navigational glass. You see him pulling a a spyglass for you. Um. At least one of these will do. And he stretches out the spyglass for you. Is this the right color? Do you like it? Hmm. That looks that looks about right to me. Um, would you recommend having one of these on uh, on the trip with me? No, I I just showed it to you because uh, yeah, I felt like it. What do you think? Yes, obviously. How much? Ah, uh, yeah. Mm, give me ten gold, and we'll call it a day. Ten gold. Yeah, why not? I'm gonna. Uh, I'll, I'll. I'll throw the, the money down on the. Um, the gold down on the counter and. And he squeezes the the glass, uh, spy glass closed, and it's only about three inches long. And he hands it over to you. Is it a- connected to like a necklace or anything that I can wear? So I can wear. Uh, it? Hmm, I could do such. I could make that for you. That would be amazing. How much extra would that cost? Uh, um, maybe give me 15 silver and I'll put it on for you. I'm going to pull out uh, a stone from uh, the castle where we came from and mm-hmm. say to him, this right here, this stone is worth far more than that. It is one of the most precious stones that you will ever find. May I give this to you instead? And he looks at it, he takes you the, why is it, it looks like concrete. Doesn't it? <laughs> but it has these properties that are magical. You mean to be concrete? No, it's, it's so that you can, you can it, it allows for you to breathe more easily when you sleep at night. What do you, oh, so I put it under my pillow. Yes, yes. And it makes it so that you don't snore at all. It makes it so that so that you almost get the best sleep that you've ever gotten. Who says I snore? Hey, if you don't, you know you don't. But I can just say that I do, and I stopped as soon as I started using this. Hmm, interesting. I will try this out, and yes, I will do this for you. Thank you. Come back, later, come back later today, and I will have it ready. The fuck? You have a non-snoring stone? Non-storing stone. I think they would kill him, right? It actually turns, <laughs> it actually turns, turns into, like, out it's a mimic. <laughs> yeah, right? It'll turn him into straw. <laughs> Hyacinth, what are you up to? Um, I think it's on the, the second story is where the rooms are, right? Mm-hmm. I think I climbed out of my, my window. Okay. At, uh, <laughs> <laughs> We're just down in the, down in the gallery. I wonder where they're getting up. <laughs> um, yeah, I think I climbed out the window. Uh, are there any like woods or like trees or anything around? Like I know it's not it's on an island, but is there kind of like a dense denser area of trees? No, you're not really on the on the. You're on the mainland right now. Uh-huh. You're in the Grand Duchy of Specularum. So this is a well-populated city. You could find parks if you want to go find a park to to sit in. Yeah, I like, will. Somewhere, you, somewhere you to watch the, the sunrise. Yeah. Where would be mm-hmm. the best spot to watch the sunrise? Oh, that would be probably at the one of the temple's towers. Okay, then I want to. I want to go there. Okay, so you can you can actually go to you find a temple to the Thander, mm-hmm. and there are priests there that greet you and say, "What can we do for you, young one?" Hello, 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 hello. No. <laughs> Um, good morning. I was just perusing around and was hoping to find a good seat for this sunrise. Hmm. I like what you're saying. <laughs> we do this all the time. And, but tell me, who do you pray to? Um. Say the three winds. 
Say the three wins. I know, right? Say the three wins. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I haven't yet decided. I've My been God, doing a lot of adventuring. <laughs> Interesting. Well, maybe our perch can change your mind. Perhaps. Lathanda is always welcome to those who are willing to serve. And they open up a door and you see a stairwell that goes up. Cool. Okay. Uh, when I go up the stairs, is there like a balcony or something I can... You can walk up the stairs and it almost become, it almost looks like you're in a minaret as you get to the top. I don't know what a minaret is. It's uh, like in that Dave Matthews song. Yes. Uh, think think Assassin's Creed, the big towers uh-huh. in Assassin's Creed. Uh-huh. That's what a minaret would look the, like. The railings are on the outside. Kind of. Yeah. Big tall it's tower. the perfect spot right. to see a religious sunset from. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. Well, it's still kind of like the sun hasn't risen yet, so it's still kind of, I think, got like a bit of orange. So I, I cast Dancing mm-hmm. Lights just, just for some company, just to like kind of mm-hmm. dance around me and be pretty. Okay. And then I just wait. And you wait, and as you see the sun come up, it is almost as if you're seeing the sun for the first time um, because it's such a beautiful sight from this view. Mm-hmm. Um, it's mesmerizing. Utterly mesmerizing. I don't feel hungover at all. I'm fully recharged. Mm-hmm. And then... Uh, when are they getting up? <laughs> I guess <laughs> when... Uh, I'm, uh, I'm feeding myself and feeding Chester. I guess once it's over, I'll make my way back and then... Uh, thank the... Like, do a, a bow to the, the priests and say thank you and... I had that picturesque moment where, like, you're up there and, like, everything's silhouetted and you can hear somebody praying loudly in the distance. Yep. <laughs> right? I don't, I don't want to pretend I know what to, how to pray. <laughs> so I'm not well, gonna... well, you, um, Hyacinth, you realize as you're walking through here, you're seeing all of these pictures and depictions of the sun and the dawn. So you chose probably the right temple to go in and watch this. Mm. As as Lathander is the de- uh, the deity of creation and, and the dawn and the sun and light. It felt very uh, spiritual, I think. Mm. So, and then I bust so through, that- when I come back uh, through, I walk through the front door. And hopefully shock everyone because they think I'm still upstairs. We're like looking. We're like looking upstairs. Like, where is she? Oh, <laughs> how did you do that? Magic. Wizards. <laughs> well, do you know where Rookie is? Uh, I think it's high time we made ourselves over to the port. Oh, she didn't tell you. She died. <sighs> Again? <laughs> do we need to res her? She's dead. So. I think I'm going to head back to the tavern at this point when I wait for the spyglass to be made, mm-hmm. uh, the necklace. Mm-hmm. Um, and, and I'm going to try to meet up with everyone. Okay. So you actually get back to the tavern and you can see um, Hyacinth just about to open the door and you see her walk in. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm going to, to creep up behind her. Okay. Um, and and, and I, I just want to startle her a little bit. So Hyacinth, you open up the door and walk in just a, you take a couple steps in and you see Brittick look at you and get shocked. And Rookie, how do you startle uh, Hyacinth? Um, do you wait till after where? I say she's dead? Yeah. Yeah. So I hear her say uh, she's dead. And then I'm just going to actually when, when she says that to, um, to Brittick, that's kind of when I want to just pop up and, and start a Brittick. Okay. Um, do I have to? No, you can no? just do it. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So I'm just going to pop up out of the shadow that's right next to Brittick mm-hmm. and just say, surprise, but I'm going to have my fangs out, my claws out. <laughs> so he, Brittick just is, is <laughs> stands there like for a beat and like doesn't move and then turns to you and goes, ah. Uh, <laughs> I jump uh, and I'm like, wah! Where did you come from? Are you, you done playing? 
Yeah. So I just went over to the store and I picked up, uh, well, I bought a spyglass, but they're turning it into a necklace. And so hopefully that'll help on our journey. Well, I need, wi- I need wizard stuff. I need to buy wizard, wizard stuff. stuff. We just spent a whole episode shopping. No, you <laughs> did. There was no wizard stuff for me. And I'm like, what's an episode? <laughs> <laughs> Antonio and Bandera, look me in the eye. All of you look me Who? in the eye. Where we're going... We don't need roads. Because we're pirates now. We're and all we're pirates to, now. We're just going to roll in loot. Don't you feel it? Adventure is on the... I'm really excited for the loot, but I just want to be able to see things in a distance. I guarantee when we're you, on the water. Captain Mole will have one. Okay, I'm going to go look right. for wizard stuff. <laughs> I'm going to go pick up my spyglass. Where? Every adventure knows you ask the tavern guy first because you at least can sell shit. Hey, tavern. I, hey, I'm gonna Mr. Tavern guy. Jump out. Ah, uh, please stop yelling. Um, <laughs> uh, is there any place around here that sells like wizard stuff? Like what? Ah. Uh, Oh god! Um, like, oh, stop it! Like what? wands and cloaks and something of the magic sort that someone of my kind might use to aid himself yeah. or herself. You serve your kind here. What? Who? No, not the parrot. Me. <laughs> oh. I wizard. No, f- screw it. All right. Yeah. Whatever. I'm gonna go outside and look for wizard stuff. <laughs> Ooh, you might want a pair of these. And I uh, go behind the bar and uh, pull out. A pair of um, like sunshade things that I saw someone in the lost and found bucket, and I pull them out, and then I put them over your face. I'm like, you might, you might need those. Cool. You have anything Archie, for what Chester? Kind of stuff are you looking for? Uh, Chester, are you dr- are you are you hungover? Are you feeling it from last night? Can birds drink? Hey, what? What are you? Waterfall. Are you talking to me? What do, what do you mean? Can birds drink? I can drink all day. I can drink all day. I can drink all night. I'll drink you under the table. I'll drink you above the table. I don't give a shit. Oh wait, hey Chester, you've lived around here for a while, right? Yeah. What about it? Is there any place around here that like sells wizard shit? Like Arch, what are you looking for? I don't know. I have money though. Don't tell the tavern guy. <laughs> you just want to buy stuff because you got money? Yeah. At least I want to get a sweet looking like. Like, I don't know, a boa or something, if we're going to be pirates. A boa? Yeah, like the feather thing that you wear. Arch. And a big hat. Hang on to that money. you got to go. The boat's, the boat's not going to be in port all day. <laughs> say <it>, Arch. <laughs> Come on, man. All right, all right. You ready for And this? I sit back down and I just keep eating. <laughs> like, no, breakfast is done. <laughs> no, not done. Okay. I, I, I kind of take a little bit and put it on a plate. And I leave a copper. <laughs> and I give it to I give it to him, and I help him up. And everybody, we had a hardy night. We probably shouldn't have done that, but we need to get in a pirate ship and act like we know what we're doing. Oh, please stop yelling! I actually that was a whisper. <laughs> <laughs> All right, are we where ready? We, where are we going, Rookie? Where 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 were you? Wait, huh? So oh, God, wake up! Sorry. I'm going to go pick up my spyglass and then I'll meet you guys back here in like Solid five point. minutes. Are we no, good? Meet us, meet us at the port. We're going to the ship. Deal. Okay. All right. Let's go. I'll take these two. Arch. Hey, hey, hey. Hi. Three. What am I? What am I? He, no. meant, he meant you. He was the, I, I, you. I'm, not I me. You. I mean, what? I should take care of herself. We, the three of us, we're the Three amigos, right? We never do anything without each other, right? Mm-hmm. Hey, yeah, that's what I'm and talking hold about. A I hold a fist bump. And he and Chester holds up three of his little claws. Oh my gosh! <laughs> and I go to, and then I go to Arch. Come on, bro. And I always hold on to your hand. Don't uh, do that. I think we got a fifty dollars donation. By the way, what? What? I think that's awesome. I'm trying to figure it All out. Right. I, I I don't know why it's not alerting on here. I'm sorry, guys. For no, the kids. Really. Oh, wait, wait. Can you can you verify that that's a fifty dollar donation? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna make sure. I, I, we have a ten, a fifteen, and it looks like a fifty. But let me double check. <laughs> I'm gonna grab a bunch of food, like cheeses and breads, and maybe some bacon. 
Nice. Like a to go, like a to like a to go lunch. Uh huh. And then I'm gonna look at uh, Britic and be like, "Do you have more of those coppers?" I'm. To be honest, I don't know where I got that. <laughs> so we okay. We had a, we had a ten dollar. Okay, I reached into my pocket and there it was. <laughs> We had a we um, had a ten dollar donation from Felicrux, a fifteen dollar donation from Irony the Goddess, and a fifty dollar donation from Saxman Mike. So, no, so awesome. Mike. thank you well, guys. It's a recurring. So, did you see this one? Yeah, but that one that one hasn't hit yet. That starts next month, I think. Hey, but that's still hey. still signed up. Mm-hmm. But hey. it's, here's the toy. Hey. Sorry. Hey. Ow, ow. Hey. No, stop what? it! Stop yelling! Hey, hey, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna help you out here. Let's go, Mister Archimedes. Okay. All right. You two need to get along. This is going to be a long voyage. You're both hey. my buddies, but I mean, come on. We're all buddies. right. All right. What? Hey, Who? listen to me. Don't Who? listen to him. Listen to me. Yes. I'm on your shoulder. I can peck your ear. Please no. You're damn right. All right. So he, t- Chester tells you to go outside and he leads you uh, down a long alleyway um, to the left of the tavern. And you at the I grab my ladder before we go. <laughs> Damn ladder. <laughs> uh, Ru- Rookie, are you following? Well, I I ran and grabbed the spyglass. Okay. And I'm Hyacinth, headed back. Hyacinth, are you following uh, Archimedes? Or what are you up if, to? Yeah, if I have a plate that I can like. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, you can you can bring a plate with you. Then yeah, I'm just following off to because uh, because uh, Burdick's going the same place, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Then yeah, I'm following them. All right, all right, come here. I got a guy. I know a guy. All right, it does fun. Archimedes? I know. Hey, I like. Hey. Okay, no, he... I wasn't talking to you. Shh, I trust yeah. the bird. You know something? We're all part of this, Chester. So you know a guy that does what? Because we already hey. got a guy. It's the hey. captain. Hey, this is this is none of your concern. This is for Archimedes. All right. Yeah, it's for me. I'm just standing at the mouth of the alley with my ladder. <laughs> 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 what? <laughs> All right, and you see you see Chester hop off of your shoulder, and he's now walking down the alleyway a little, and you see him turn right, and you see him knock three times with his beak on the wall. And you see, and as you're walking up, you see him just keep knocking and knocking and knocking and knocking, and then the wall slowly moves inwards and opens up into a doorway. I whisper over to Archimedes and be like, okay, so that's a, that's a secret passage. It takes about, like, what, 22, 23 knocks? Did you get how many knocks that was? I, it I'm, was exactly uh, 27. Are we are we talking bird knocks? Yeah, like... Oh, uh, I think it was eight. What? Eight knocks. Uh, it's, I don't know, it's low. I'm just saying, remember that. Hey, do you guys want to keep talking, or do you want to come in? It, we're, yeah, I'm, I, just, I just follow Chester. All, All right, right hey, hey, there's some rules. When you come in here, you do not look at Jacomo in the eyes. Where do we look him? Wherever you want. That's not in his eyes. We got the ear just like over him. I don't care what you do. I'm just telling you right now. If you want to get back out of here, listen to me. All right. I trust. I trust you, Chester. Let's do this. Damn right you do. Okay. And as you walk in. You see, this is almost a laboratory. You see um, petri dishes. You see uh, te- test tubes, beakers uh, on that are underneath or on top of flames. And you see a little gnome pop up from behind <laughs> the beakers, and he has just two giant glasses. And he says, oh, "What are you doing here? Who are you?" I, I look you? over. I look over his shoulder. Yeah, I look over. And I, I'm just like, uh, so, uh, excuse me, are you, are you Giacomo? That's what I am. That's who I am. Cool. Chester cool. sent us. Where? It all Wait, whoa, whoa. Chester sent you? Yeah, Chester said you might have some uh, wizard shit for me. I think you used that term. Yeah. Yeah, I could do that. Oh, okay. And, and, and then you hear Chester's like, you're damn right you're going to do that. You, I, you owe me big. <laughs> Can I walk All over right. and then just with that, like looking at him, but maybe just putting just to the left of him and put my hand out and say, hello, I'm I'm Hyacinth. Nice to meet you. Hey, don't, nice don't to meet you, too. Don't look him in the eye. <laughs> don't look him in the eye. Thank you so much for having us in your uh, your uh, 
laboratory. Home. Hey, look at me when I'm talking to you. That's kind of rude not to look not, at me. Not in the eye. But not in the eye. Hi. Hello. He- hello. I'm just like Why looking. Aren't you looking at I'm me? like looking at his mouth. Look at his mouth. Look at his ears. Hey, hey. My face is up here, not down there. Well, Chesta just said that it was probably a good idea if we didn't make direct eye contact with you. What? And you just hear Chester giggling like that. <laughs> <laughs> you just, and I can't believe they fell for that. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and you hear, Chester, you're such an asshole. <laughs> Chester, I think, I think you and I are going to be best friends. And I like, yeah, I, 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 I look over at Brittick and I'm like, yeah, we're going to be best friends. <laughs> I apologize for that. Uh, That's okay. I'm working off a hangover still, so. But I, I, you know what? Chester's right. I do owe him. So let me go see what I can find. And you, you, you see him turn around and he's just throwing stuff around. You see just boots and cloaks <laughs> and everything just flying to the point where you can't even see him. He's like, ah, I know it's somewhere. I know it's somewhere. Out of just control. Dodge, just dodging boots and stuff. And he comes back out and he throws a pair of boots on, on the counter in front of you. And he says, here, have these. Like for free? Yeah. Who, 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 him? All right. Or for that 50 donation to Extra Life. What are the two? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Sounds good. And I, I'm like, I like look at him. I kind of put them against my foot. I'm like, oh, they're my, they're my size. And I, I slip them on. Yeah. Oh, okay. And then as you slip them on, you start to float off the ground a little bit. Oh, right? God. Am I... Is this just me, off? or am I actually floating? Hmm? I'm like, I'm, I'm asking him, like, am I actually floating, or am I... I, like, get down on my knees and do this underneath his feet. <laughs> yeah, you're like, yeah. this far off. You, you, you Michael Blaine it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, uh, yeah. I mean, it, it, uh, yeah, it looks like you are. Can you turn it off, Arch, or do you gotta, like, take the boots off? I don't know what I'm doing right now. Focus, man! Focus! <laughs> Ow. Think, think about the ground. Hey Giacomo, how do I how do I get less off the ground? Think about the ground. We told you. See, duh. And he focuses and you, really hard on putting his feet on the ground. And and you just fall to the ground. He's like, and you hear Chester. Whoa, buddy, watch where you're going with these things. Sorry. Jeez. Sorry. What what are the what are what are these things called? Uh, what well, I mean I mean it's quite obvious you were levitating, right? I mean, I guess, yeah. I raised my hand. I raised my hand. Uh, we're not in class, but you in the back. Boots of levitation. Nailed it. <laughs> I just walk out. I just walk out. Well, Giacomo, thank you so much. I'm, these will probably come in, in handy, especially. Do they work above water, or do you need power to get over water? Not oh, there. Come on. You know hoverboards don't work without <laughs> Don't deny me a hoverboard, Rick. Ever. <laughs> uh, sorry, I, I, uh, did, did they do work the over water? I want, Rick. Yes, they work over water. Dude, jeez, you know, right? can you levitate? God, you're some wizard you are. All right, all right. That's, Just want to double check. That's cool. That's very cool. Uh, Hyacinth met you just a moment ago. I am yeah. also a wizard and a <laughs> companion of Chester. And yeah. if you have anything just kind of lying around... For a wood elf wizard that you think might be handy for it, adventuring at sea. Just saying. Uh, mm, I don't have anything just yet, but let me see what I can find, and maybe I'll have uh, one of Chester's friends um, fly it over to you. Thank you. Final request. Very last yes. request. But you have a lot of potions around here. I was yeah, sure. Got potions. Potions for days. I, yeah. So I was wondering if maybe you had a shrinking potion and that maybe you also had a pirate hat and that maybe you could shrink the pirate hat because I have a little spider friend that I think would look really cute with a pirate hat. I know it's kind of a strange ask. Or do you just have a tiny pirate hat? Or, I mean, if you just have a tiny pirate hat. Let's not overcomplicate things. A shrinking potion with a hat. Hmm. Hmm, I think we can make this work. 
and you see him go back into his pile of stuff and just start throwing more shit around. You see more robes go flying. You see several hats go flying, but they're not, you don't think they're of any real piratey nature. Mm-hmm. No tricorns. They, they look more like a, uh, uh, religious hats. But he comes back and he says, oh, how about this one? And you see this amazing um, black leather tricorn hat with a red um, feather stuck in it. It's perfect. Yep, hold on. And he pours this uh, blue fluid over the top of it. And you just see poof, a, a little bit of smoke fly out of it. And then uh, the, the hat is now the size of a quarter. Amazing. May I? Yeah, sure. I just sweep it up into my hand. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Damn it, did it's he already have true. a pirate hat? <laughs> he does, but we can we, we can just say that this is how he got it. Now he has options. This is his episode zero? <laughs> <laughs> I thought he only had a hook. I didn't realize he had a hat. Aw. Anyway. Well, let's just say he didn't have one and he had uh, only a hook before. Anyway, well, thank you so much. This is going to make a wonderful (coughs) present, excuse me, present for a friend of mine. Oh, yeah, absolutely. You don't have any bird clothes, do you? (laughs) Do birds wear clothes? Whoa, whoa, you're trying to put clothes on me now? Do I try to put clothes on you, buddy? (laughs) I just thought it'd be cool to see you. got a point with that. That's really legit. It'd be cool to see you with like a cape on. (gasps) Tiny pants. (laughs) I'll I'll agree to that. I'll agree to the cape. I would look badass in a cape. And I I, I kind of start and, fi- I start fishing through all the stuff that got thrown around. And do yeah. I find any sort of like little like little pocket of of fabric or anything? You do. You actually find um, you don't find anything small, but you do find a black cape that almost matches the tricorn hat that uh, hyacinth. Um, had you know had shrunk but on the back of the cape there is um two they almost look like lightning bolts that shoot down but they're red lightning bolts Ooh. Nice. hey uh hey giacomo do you need this thing for anything yeah. no it's kind of dumb but you can have it it's cool it's no big deal could could you do that shrinky thing again and i can give it to our our uh, chester buddy here if for chester anything for chester i'll tell you that much all right and I hand it and over. He, pour, he pours it over, pours the the food over it, and you see the cape shrink down to size. And then I I take it and I kind of like gently put it over Chester's neck. Fuck yeah! Look at this! I look amazing. I dude, you look cool as shit. And I go to give him a hey, fist bump. Up. Yeah, and he gives you a club club trick. <laughs> Best friends for and life, I, I y'all. <laughs> oh, here oh, you go. I, I, I left. I left, right, I left the building. The what? What you love? What? Excuse I left me? the building. I'm actually oh. not there. <laughs> so I'm talking to myself is what you're telling me right yeah. now. Yeah, that's great. Cool. All right. Well, Giacomo, thank you very much. I'm sure these will come in handy. Yes, thank you. I got a rookie to go boat. I mean, what? I got a boat to go meet my friend Rookie. What? <laughs> All right. And then I leave. It's like, <laughs> like awkwardly. <laughs> Okay. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, I didn't realize I didn't say anything. <laughs> when you guys go outside, you don't see Burdick immediately, but then you realize he's at the top of his ladder, which is uh, leaning against the wall outside the shop. And he's just kind of shaking it, testing it. The fuck are you, the knight? Like, <laughs> I just haven't. Ever, I haven't. I realized I haven't been up this ladder since I got it, and I didn't want to. I didn't want it to malfunction in the middle of the field. I climbed back down, <laughs> saw the ladder. Why do we still have the ladder though? You guys, you guys roll with this guy. I mean, he's a little. <laughs> no, I'm prepared. Oh Chester. yeah, yeah, great, I'm prepared, fantastic. Uh huh. Yeah, wonderful. What are you prepared for? Uh, anything. I could see this cape. <laughs> are you Are you still on top of the ladder? It's a pretty fancy. No, cape. I, I walked down. Oh, okay, you did. Yeah. yeah. So I like to imagine that I picked up my spyglass <laughs> like ages ago, and yeah, yeah you and, have spyglass. For some reason, I thought that they would just head directly to the boat, so I booked it, and I was just flipping over everything and trying to get the fastest route I could possibly take <laughs> to get down to the harbor. Okay. 
So you make your way to the harbor and you find, if I can get this thing right, you find the cursed curse sitting there in the harbor. <laughs> cursed curse. Oh, that's cool. That's a double wow. negative, right? Yeah. I don't so know. I don't think well, in this situation okay. that's a double negative. But, but it means it's just not a cursed boat, right? Well, it's, like, it's extra cursed. The curse is cursed. Damn. So, it's again, what was the name cursed. of the fellow or the, the person who was our... Um, Mole or Mall? Mall. Mall? Like Darth? Mall. Yes. Okay. Mall. Um, so, I'm going to approach the... Uh, the the ship and say ahoy there is a captain mall here ah he's on the boat but why should we let you in well firstly you guys are here to take me to a far off land and secondly i have a spirit who belongs on this ship all right. Also, I see a perch way up there that has my name on it. So I'll be out of your hair in a second if you just let me on this boat. How do I know you're, you're who you say you are? Well, what do you know about the people that are going to be on your ship? The people that are going to be on my ship? Yeah. Well, or this the ship. If it's not yours. I, I, I know there were four of them. And can you explain or describe anything about them? Yeah, one, uh, there were two women, two men. One uh, was really drunk, really drunk. The other was, you know, uh, headstrong. <laughs> Very determined to hire people. He didn't really care who he hired, which was Mostly a little drunk. Funny. Yeah. <laughs> I was. I'm a little frightened for this journey. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, I mean, I did not say that. I did. I, there is no journey happening. I don't know who you are. I don't you know, know who, who I am. Does this ring a bell? And I'm going to grow my fangs down. Holy Jesus! Okay. All right. Okay. I get. That. Okay. 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 Are you picking up what I'm putting down? <laughs> oh, I pick. I'm not put. I'm not picking up anything. I'm gonna walk away. <laughs> you can. You can. You can just go up the plank. Okay, so as I as I uh, walk no past touchy. him, no touchy, no touchy. I <laughs> I I wink at him, and I I uh, I, I jump onto the uh, the boat, and as soon as I get up on the ship, um, I'm going to firstly look for the captain. Mm -hmm. And you see, Maul is up on the in the on the helm area on the back part of the ship, uh, two uh, stair floors up. And you see him looking over the, the edge, staring at the sea. Okay. I go up to him and I say, Captain. Hey, what are you doing? It's nice to see you guys finally made it. Nice we're to be here. To, we're ready to set sail. Are you ready to go? Yeah, my buddy should be here any moment. But until then, is it cool if I just go hang out up top? Yeah, why not? Just let me know if you see anything out of the ordinary. Aye, aye. And I'm going to, uh, I'm basically just going to flip my way up up the uh the mast and okay. sit at the very top kind of just hang out there and and watch for my friends so i'm gonna be kind of like sitting where one leg is hanging off of um what is what is the term that i'm looking for the crow's nest yes so mm -hmm. like my one, one leg is hanging down i'm just kind of chilling there mm -hmm. with a little helob up here and, and you made your way up the the uh, mast of the boat so well that the entire crew is just in awe of your athletic prowess as you made it from mass to mass up up the the sheets and into the crow's nest cool okay i'm just gonna hang out there and wait for everyone and i'm a little surprised that they aren't here yet so i'm a little worried but i'm just gonna hang out until i hear otherwise it hasn't, it hasn't gotten too long yet like yeah and helob kind of makes his way out and just perches on the crow's nest next to your foot a little just to to uh kind of scope out the territory too. And then you see there's a giant gust of wind that blows you back into the into the crow's nest itself and knocks you down. So you can just see up and you see Helot come flying at your face. <laughs> what? But you also see that his hat goes flying overboard. Uh -huh. 
He lost it. Um, okay, so I'm gonna catch him really fast, and I say, Ah, oh, your head! What are we gonna do? I mean, you, you just see him paw at you a little with one of his eight legs. Okay. It's kind of like he's just sad. Um, I'm going to look over, and I'm I'm going to see if maybe I can dive after it. Okay. Um, it's too tiny, so you don't see where it went. I'm just gonna jump. To okay. <laughs> roll uh, me an, roll me an athletics check. Can be acrobatics. Yeah, sure. Yes. And this is where we lose Rookie. <laughs> so passes Rookie. <Yeah. laughs> oh. Well. Okay. So you jump off the side of the crow's nest, and now you are forming a swan dive down into the water, and you strike the water, and you go about ten feet under because of the the force that you that you had falling down, and this water is just murky as you're as you're in it. It is it's almost you can feel the germs just penetrating your skin and covering you in dirt and mud. Okay, I'm like I'm basically paralyzed as I as I hit the water and and I'd like to just float up to the surface and just kind of like I'm I'm like I'm I'm, I'm so paralyzed that I just don't move and I just stare straight up into the sky and I don't know what else to do. I just lay there. And, and you see you see Maul look over the side of the boat. He's like, <laughs> "Rookie, what are you doing? That was funny, but I wouldn't recommend doing it again." You know I lost something, and and my voice is so shrill because I can't handle everything around me, but I don't know what else to do, so I'm just going to lay there. Uh, do you want us to pull you in? You know, it's just when you have a moment that might be cool. Might be oh. nice. All right. <laughs> hey, Flop, get over here. And you, flop. you, you see... Flop. <laughs> one, of, one of the crew head over. He's like, <laughs> what did she do? You know, as they usually do when they're looking to, you know, get a refreshing swim in. But I didn't realize that this place was so polluted. Yeah. Uh, Flop, could you do your thing? Certainly. And he, you see him. Tie, tie a rope almost into a lasso and chucks it out at you and it cinches on your left foot and as <laughs> as he pulls it back it grasps grabs your le left foot tight and they it's he slowly starts to pull you back to the ship so and he's you, hanging upside down yeah you can you can see the rope is you know pulling overneath the side rail okay and it's He's slowly pulling you up, and now you're up out of the water, but you're upside down with one foot being pulled up. Okay. Up the rail. <laughs> oh, and, and I say, and I say, do you guys have anything that'll get this stuff off me? <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> Not the smartest move you've made today. Yeah. And, and you're just slowly being pushed up, like foot by or pulled up foot by foot. And it's jerking you over to the left and to the right, and just pulling you up and up and up, and then you're finally back on the on the deck. Maul's looking at you. He's like, <laughs> "I wouldn't have done that, but you." <laughs> well, you know, it turns out that that we lost an heirloom, and I had to go look for it, but it's gone. Say, Livy, I guess. But uh, do you have any fresh water by any chance? Uh. I'm still hanging upside down, right? No, yeah, a little bit. We could, yeah, we could get, we could drench you in water. That's fine. Okay. And you just see a couple of a uh, couple of other of the crew c with buckets, and they just, uh, you see, flop, lower you down a little bit. Okay. On, I'm gonna on, pull out on. my waterlogged soap and just scrub <laughs> my skin as much as possible. Soap on a rope. And, and they're literally they're dumping all of this. And I bring Heal up out and I say, I'm I'm sorry, little buddy. Looks like uh looks like your little hat is is long gone. And he just paws at you a little. Mm. The sea salt in his hair. 
Okay, so yeah, I, I wipe it away. Yeah, what what is everybody else doing? Uh, real quick, we got another ten dollar donation and a fifteen dollar donation. So oh, yeah, Felix Rocks awesome. with another ten and Thomas Corey with a fifteen. So thank you very much, guys. Thank you, everyone. Go for it. Thank you, guys. Thank you guys are the best for the kids. For the kids. Well, kids. Hashtag for D kids. Uh, I I am now wandering towards the boat. Okay. And uh, yeah, I assume we're probably all wandering that direction. Mm-hmm. There okay. she is, the cursed curse. I say as we <laughs> and it comes into vision. I like and you can e- you can easily make out the boat. I like to think that as because we're walking to the boat, cursed. like if there's like kind of like a like a walkway, like a plank way or whatever, I just kind mm-hmm. of make just a, like a you know crow fly direct line to it where I'm stepping like on wood and then I'm floating above the air over the water and then I'm back on wood where I'm just kind of like, but I don't realize I'm doing it. It's like you're walking on the moon for the yeah. first yeah. time. Yeah. Like just, yeah. it just like there's no drop anymore for me, so I'm just like, oh, it's kind of still nursing a hangover. I I lean over to Hyacinth and I'm like, that's gonna make him throw up. <laughs> like I'll now, up. I'm just are falling, you, are you, and I'm really excited. And I have this little hat. <laughs> <laughs> I hope there's place. I hope there's a place to put my ladder on this place on this ship. <laughs> Is it just on your shoulder like a boombox, but it's a ladder? Yeah, just it's like, well, yeah. I mean, it's like you put an arm through a rung and you just hold on oh, to it. Oh, sorry. Yeah. It's a ladder. Yeah. You, you actually just hold it up in front of somebody's <laughs> apartment. It's like three stooges. <laughs> it's like uh, my head is through the rungs and I'm holding it. Going to John Cusack over here. Mm-hmm. Uh, so you you make it to the to the ship. Mm. There, uh, Archimedes, you're levitating to the ship at this point. Well, yeah, I'm just, and, yeah. Do I? But I don't know. I'm just like walking. In a straight yeah, line. yeah. You're 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 walking, but at, at some points you just kind of hop up and hop down and hop up and hop down. It's like you got moon shoes on. Moon <laughs> shoes. Moon shoes. <laughs> um, but you do make it to the to the ship itself, and the plank is there. There's nobody guarding it this time, or you don't see anybody guarding it. Interesting. Where's all the men we paid for? You see them up. Uh, you can actually see scurrying going on on the on the deck of the boat. Oh, good! They're working the ship, and mm. we'll just on our way up and place my ladder down on the deck and, and it doesn't fall overboard. As you place your ladder down, everybody's like, "Britic, Britic, ha, <laughs> Britic, my people." <laughs> well, I say Britic or Xavier. Shit, they're on to me. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. I'll just change my name again when we get off the boat. To be honest, to be fair though, when I was drunk, I was calling myself Britic. That's true. So, <laughs> I'm like, I put my hand out immediately. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, <laughs> link into the shadow, and, be, and, and I whisper to Archimedes, "It's like they don't suspect a thing." Wait, and I'm just like, wait, what's happening? Where's where? I shove Archimedes forward. Oh, Britic, a pleasure. Hello. Um, how is everyone uh, this morning? Where's your captain? Oh, captain Maul. Who called me? Britic did. And, 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 and you see shove Maul. Shove our forward again. You see Maul come to the front of the platform that he's on in front of the wheel, uh, the helm. Uh, captain, I speak for our group's leadership, Britic, here. Um <laughs> We we're waiting for one more of our compatriots. Uh, Who are you waiting for, Xavier? Rookie is her name. She's oh, a- she's here already. Where, Rook? Where are you? I'm still hanging upside down, right? Oh yeah, hold on one second. We gotta pull her over the side. Why is she dangling over the side? Let her, she can explain that to you. I'm not going near it with a 50 foot pole. Did she? It, she did she, it herself. It's her own volition. I am. I am not she, responsible for this. I lean over to Malt. She climbed up to the uh, um, uh, the perch. What do you call it? Crow's Perth- nest. The crow's nest and jumped off. Right. Yeah. God. How did you know that? Yeah. It's like you. Wow. I'm just like. <laughs> <laughs> so as I'm coming up, um, it's out of the boat. I have I have Hila, but I'm holding Hila upright. Mm-hmm. And I say, you guys, I have the worst news. We lost Elob's hat. Elob had a hat? <sighs> I walk away. Yeah. Boy, that hat wasn't for where, Chester. I go up to wherever the steering thing is. The helm. The steering <laughs> thing. <laughs> I say that out loud. I'm going up to the steering thing. 
He looks so naked it's without it. A what? Lance. It's what? called a lance. What? Hello. Helop doesn't need to be very sad. He doesn't need to be sad for very much longer. What do you mean? I got him. I'm still hanging upside down. <laughs> and then I, uh, I, are you still upside down? Yeah. So yeah. <laughs> So I, I'm just unfazed <laughs> by the digital. fact that you're upside down. Just walk over and I'm like, look, I got this made for him. And then I, I show you this tiny little hat with the red feather. That's amazing. It's and and um, I, I hold out Helob so you could place you could place the hat on his head. Oh, gosh. How does this work? <laughs> <laughs> it's magical. I need to get him a little feather. Um. Hey, hey, Chester, have you met Helob yet? Whoa, what the hell is that thing? I, I'm crying a little bit, but I wipe it away super quickly so it's you guys like can see it. It's like going down your face this yeah. way. Yeah, <laughs> it's going down this way, and I'm like, oh, God. Oh, I, also, I, I should mention that uh, Shadow and Leon have been following me around this whole time, too, right? Ret yep. Retcon. Whoa, Leon, lion? the lion? lion. Yeah. We brought the lion? Yeah, we brought the lion. I brought a ladder. We got a lot of L things. <laughs> what? Cool. Hey, wait. So let me get this straight. You will roll around with this eight-legged thing that just needs a, a hat and it has a hook? This eight-legged thing will likely save your life fairly what you, soon. Hey, whoa, 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 young one. I have not talked to you yet. Then who are you addressing right now, uh, sir? My, my buddy Archimedes right here. That's I'm still hanging upside down, by the way. I'm still kind of swinging. Wait, which one are you, are you talking about? The cat or the dog? The spider. What the heck is that thing? Oh, yeah, that's hers. That's Rookie's. All right, as long he as loves his, his own Spider-Man Chester. person. Chester. Spider. Chester. If I made a saddle for Leon, would you ride Leon around? Oh, this isn't oh, yeah. Narnia, oh, yeah. Archimedes. Yeah, we, yeah. <laughs> we, 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 need, we need to do this right now. Okay. Yes. Wait, okay. And immediately I start looking moment, for like leather scraps. Wait a minute, wait a minute. At that moment, I want to shoot an arrow in the middle of this group <laughs> on the deck. Just <laughs> We're ready to shove off, aren't we? We have a mission. Oh. I sigh and I go, yeah. I just start I start hanging upside down. Pond. I start helping Ricky. As, as you're um, hanging upside down, mm -hmm. you can see Helob's other little hat just floating. Can I shoot the rope that's hanging it's her? Floating? That mm -hmm. she's hanging from? Like in the water? Mm -hmm. Hey, I say you guys, you 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 guys, and I start squirming while you guys try to get me down. Can I shoot the rope she's hanging from so she falls on the deck and not in the water? <laughs> She's. If you did, she's over. She's over the side of the. Oh, she's over the water now. Chester, mm -hmm. can, uh, Chester, can you see that yo. thing floating in the water right there? Yeah, I can see that thing. What? What? What about it? Is there any chance I can convince you to go grab it? I want to do something. Oh God, you want me to? You want me to? What, what is it? It's. It's. I. What is it, rookie? It's. It's. It's Helob's hat. He just got a freaking hat. Why do I got to go do another thing for a? Spider? Helob needs choices. If that were your Ooh. hat, we'd get it for you. Hey, we just got a seventy dollar donation to Extra Life. All right, I'll go that's down. That's awesome! Get that <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's awesome! Thanks, John. Oh, wait, hey, or oh, that was a test. Doesn't matter. That's uh, still Never good mind. though. <laughs> wait, <laughs> wait, is that John? The John you talked about earlier? No, yeah, no. The, the, yeah, yeah, the yeah, gender John. neutral okay. John. I should have glanced over, saw that. So anyway. What do you mean it's a test? Are you not getting these donations? No, no. That donation was a test. Kasavari, because I'm trying a different thing. Kasavari tested it. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> That's funny. Anyway, sorry. No, I'm joking. <laughs> um, okay, so does Chester try, try to go get the hat? Well, yeah, he, he flies. He's like, ah, fine. I'll do it for you, buddy. For you. Wait, why are we getting another hat? Just wait. <laughs> Wait for it. I think he's going to turn it into a saddle. <laughs> okay. So he flies down and he, you, you see Chester just swoop down, pick it up with his, his claws and fly back up. Put, he drops it on the top of your head, Archimedes, and then puts, then lands on your shoulder. And then I, I look at Helob and I go, ah, like I'm like this one or that one, which one? But um, well, he really, he, he's going to um, look 
kind of back and forth. I kind of look up and look over and look, and then some of his eyes look over and some of his eyes look up. And uh, and he's he's going to take his, cl- his his hook and point at this one. Okay. On his head. And I kind of like toast, and then I go Chester, and I put it on his head. Today you're officially part of the amateur hour. Ha <laughs> ha! That's what I'm talking about. This is cool. <laughs> That's not meta at all. <laughs> <laughs> or whatever we call ourselves. This ragtag bunch of, of wackos. Chester, I don't think we've met. British Battalion, he yells down from. <laughs> I'm Hyacinth. He's like, I'm, I'm just like behind the wheel. It's not going anywhere. <laughs> and by don't think I've met, we've met, I mean, don't think we've met sober. What? Hey, what? Who? What, what'd you say? I'm Hyacinth. Hi. I don't think we've met properly. At least not Hello. sober. Okay. That's great. I just want to introduce myself properly, seeing as we're going oh. to be uh, compadres for the next little while. And also, I, know, I got the hat. I really That's dig great. your fancy hat. Thank you. I dig it pretty. I, I, my boy Archimedes got it for me. It matches your cape very nicely. Uh, yes, it does. It's a fantastic. Look at He's outfitting me. Got so much to draw. I'm gonna get you a a, a bandolero next. <laughs> can I just like? Can I just? Uh, it's lovely to talk to you, Chester. Can I just take off your meetings? To you too. That's all I'm saying. I, I'm, I appreciate you coming and talking to me in this manner. Oh well, I pr- I appreciate you, Chester. I appreciate you appreciating me. And I'm gonna get him a saddle. <laughs> all right, you guys, let's 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 get out of here. <laughs> whoa, whoa, hey, we just pulled you all your stuff out of the water, or you know, oh, look who's I'm ready like to go. Everything I'm, about the, I'm about the wheelie thing. Oh, look who's ready to go. <laughs> can I can I ask Chester? Uh, Chester, do you mind if I if I talk to Archimedes? Just 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 he and I just for a second. Fine. <laughs> I'll back off. All right. It's okay. It's okay. You got things to say. You can't say in front of me. I get it. Whatever. <laughs> I appreciate it. Thank it's all, you. It's all good, buddy. And, and you see him hop down. You see him hop onto um, one of the railings of the boat, and you see him kind of playing with his <laughs> wing and it's adjusting like his hat. His little, his little wing shoulders just like moving yeah. around. <laughs> you don't think that all the special attention you're paying to Chester isn't going to upset Leon and Shadow at all. Oh no, not at all. They're they're my they're my boys or girl. Isn't girl. Shadow a... Girl and boy. Did we establish what Leon was? I'm a, Leon's I don't know. Ma- Gen- gender a neutral. Boy, yeah. But it's a boy. It's He's a boy. boy. He's a boy. So they're going to be fine They're even fine. Though? And I look over and I see like I see them doing the thing where they're like chasing each other's tail like slowly and making like a little yin yang circle. Mm-hmm. See, they're fine. All right. Don't worry, I got this. Just make sure you love them too. Hey, hey, do you have anything that I could craft a saddle out of, like a tiny saddle? Oh, you know, a you know what? Uh, absolutely not. <sighs> right, well, if you see anything, let me know. <laughs> I shoot another arrow into the deck. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I will Swiss cheese this boat. <laughs> Brittany, um, I mean, it's Avia. A Brazavia. <laughs> Have I been cut down? I thought I helped you down a little bit. Did you? I don't know. Yeah, okay. you're, you're down now. Yep. So I'm wringing all my stuff out. And I'm like, all right, all right. Ready when you guys are. And I'm going to climb up back to the crow's nest. <laughs> Captain Mole, if I could have your attendance at the wheel thing. Attention at I the helm? I just, spin it. I just give it a spin. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, did I tell? Did I say you could use that? No. Don't touch it. Got it. Are you guys ready? Are you done screwing around? Some of us are. I've been ready I'm this gonna... whole time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna take off my spyglass and just whip it out, and like it'll just unfold. Whoa, that's pretty big. I'm wondering, Captain. That's how I like it. You know how to get to the Isle de Muerte. <laughs> yeah. Then let's set sail. Let's hoist the main and miss the mast. How's the poop deck? Swabbed? <laughs> Did- I'll go, I'll go oh. down deck. Oh, yeah, I'll go down deck. Hell. I have to check on my ladder. 
get down. <laughs> and as it go down the steps, Archimedes, have you seen Britic? <laughs> Wait. You? No, and I grab shoulder, he hasn't, like, and I grab he hasn't my seen him. And just rush him forward. He hasn't seen him. You guys hear me yell from above, land ho! <laughs> I, grab, I grab the ladder and I over to the rest of the crew who's he's upstairs and I'm like, I'm not entirely sure this crew knows what they're doing. And, I'm and not entirely you, sure we know what we're doing. You you see Maul. You look. You can look back and see Maul, and he just face palms his, himself. Either way, a lend in. It's the only way we're going to survive these ruffians, because I'm not sure enough. I'm not sure the coin we put up is enough to gain their full cooperation. Pirates, you know. Xavier, I think you're talking really loud, and they can all hear you. But. <laughs> Fear not, everyone. We know exactly what we're doing and what our mission is. And we very much appreciate your enthusiasm uh, being here, taking us with you across the seas. And uh, we are very excited for our journey ahead. Riddick, where are we going again? The Isle de Muerte. And I hoist my ladder. <laughs> Dial the Muerte. Got it. Mm -hmm. And I sit down next to uh, Shadow and Leon. I need to go secure my ladder. I'm going to be in a pose up above where like, I'm pointing and my, my other <laughs> arm is at my side and I have one of my feet up uh, um, with my knee up kind of sort of mm -hmm. thing. And I'm just waiting for it to go. That's good. I see that and I do something similar. <laughs> I tie my ladder to the deck and then I get... I crawl out onto the side, you know, where the rope goes up from the side of it up to the mast, and I hang out onto the side. <laughs> and I say, I've never, I've never been a sailor Engage. Before. I just walk up to Maul. Hey, you don't give the orders here, buddy. Oh, sorry. I just go up to Maul and I Disengage. say, I go up to Maul and I say, uh, I, I just apologize. I'm like, I'm sorry. We are genuinely ready when you are. You can't punch her's mark on the ship. I say, I say, I made you. And you hear yar. a yar. <laughs> And you just see Maul just putting his hand. <laughs> you know when like you're on a horse and the horse isn't going and you just kind of kick it and it still doesn't go? I do that to the side of the ship. Are we moving? All right, boys, let's set sail. And you see the ropes that are holding the uh, the ship to the dock just be cast off. And the ship slowly starts to sail out of port. And it's like beautiful. Right? It's like yeah. The sails unfurl. There's yeah. like a horn blowing. The wind is perfect. Yeah, it's exactly. The, the, red sh the, the blood red sheets of the sails are taut in the wind that is shooting from behind you. And I let out a hearty yar. I and I yell it after you as well. And I just yell it back. <laughs> it's just back and forth. Going. I just go up to Maul and I just say, "Where am I out of the way?" Uh, why do you need to be out of the way? Just out of out of the way of 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 the things turning and and I don't want to get under under anybody's feet. I just want to make sure that I let you guys oh, trust do. Me. With this crew, it's not going to matter. I do. Well, this, gonna, this is going to. This is going. This is going to be an interesting trip. I can tell you that much. What does that mean? It means I'm throwing up over the edge. Of the <laughs> area. I'm hardly even going off. <laughs> <laughs> don't. Don't mind. Do you see the crew. Do you see the crew we're working with. I haven't met them all yet. No. No. Well, you you could go say hi, but they're not the brightest of folks. That's all I'm saying. And as, as the two of them are talking, I kind of walk up and I sort of interrupt. I go, uh, "Excuse me, Captain." Yeah. You don't happen to have a bird-sized saddle for a lion, do you? Oh, <laughs> uh, what? Okay, don't worry about it. Oh, and God, then I walk away. Just as bad as. Oh, what did I get myself into? <laughs> 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 Welcome to. <laughs> Timing. Timing. Eric, you call there if you wanted to. 
So you you sail for about a, a, a day sail, and nothing out of the ordinary happens. And then it's about midday on the second day of sailing. Britic, you're still hucking over the side. No one's actually asked him, but he's never been on a ship. But as you're as you're throwing up over the the um, bow of the boat, it's terrible. You can you look up and through your water dripped eyes and the the vomit that has been coating your mouth you see another ship coming your way oh, um uh, land no sail ship oh as you're trying to say this i look down at you i'm like stop chucking at the bow go to the stern and i just say no over there horizon I'm going to take out my spyglass. I start pointing at it. Okay. Um, you, uh, Rookie, you see, as you take out your spyglass, you can see the ship and something strange about it. The people that are walking on the deck are moving in such a manner that it's almost... Um, it's almost like they're popping and locking essentially something's wrong their their bodies don't seem to be moving in in a manner that you would you would think human it's a boy and you, you also you oh, also uh, skull and crossbones <laughs> flying from the top of the sh- uh, the ship <laughs> i'm going to stare at it for a second and then I'm going to say, steer clear, steer clear. And I'm going to start flipping down all of the ropes and try to get down the mast as quick as possible, as quickly as possible. What are you yapping at? I yell ship ahoy, but just like half of it's vomit. <laughs> I'm going to say that they're not, not normal skulls and bones and, and not good. I and I'm trying to flip. I'm trying to say this as I'm flipping down. Oh, can I do a power? I have a power. The power? Power of the babe. Do we? What, what do, you, do we have? I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use my power. What, what, what power? Before what you, you use your power, because yep. because uh, state fan. State fan. State fan. Donated. State fan just dropped two hundred fifty dollars in our extra life. Yeah, state fan. Love That's you. amazing. That's fantastic. It's awesome to see you at RTX, and thank you for this uh, donation. It's oh very my gosh. Thank you, and thank Kazuar you so much for the <laughs> for the the uh, couple of dollar test things that he's been working on. But yeah, thank you so much, state fan. That was thanks, state fan. That's cr- that's very that's awesome. Amazing. Sorry. Xavier's doing for Xavier. Stay fan. I'm gonna stay fan. I'm gonna work that into next week's game. Just so you know. Um. So you see, uh, rookie. What are you doing? You're you're informing uh, Maul of what's going on. Yeah, I'm trying to yell as I'm trying to focus on getting down. It's just a mess. I'm a wreck. This okay. New. <laughs> <laughs> and, and you see Maul walk down. He's like, let me, fine, I'll look. And he, you, you see him, he goes to the bow. You see him turn around, he says, and he's got a smile on his face. And you don't see any sense of, of fear in him. He's like, I've been waiting for this for a long time. Hoist the colors, boys! And you see the blood red sheets all get draped anew with black sheets that all have uh, skull and crossbones on them. Sweet. This is going to be fun. Make sure the cannons are loaded. Bring the ship around. And that's what's happening. That's where we'll end for the evening. So uh, we're going where pirating. Am I, where am I good out of the way? <laughs> <laughs> Rar. We're all pirates now. Yes. This is awesome. I'm excited. I just like the idea. I'm finally like I'm gonna be not hung over so I can actually like, participate. <laughs> but no, here's the thing. Like we might be the bad guys in this instance. We could be. Well we might be 
looting and murdering the boy band ship. But they looked kind of like, strange, right? Mm-hmm. Well, we something. could find out if they're a certain thing if we're within a mile of them with my primeval awareness. Oh, is that what you're going to do? Yeah, it just tells you if it's fiends or undead or something else. Um, oh, we just got another $15 donation as well. Thank oh you very much. Oh my gosh, people are amazing. That one actually popped up too. I Yay! have sound for it, buddy. That's awesome. I don't, why are they not popping up? Oh, yeah. I see so, it. you guys, I, I have a thing. So, next week, I'm going to be in, um, well, I'm flying over to Toronto and I'm going to be in a place north of Toronto that has like hardly any internet internet access, but I might be able to get some, Aww. but you guys should still play without me if I can't make it. And then it's going to be a pirate fight. It's literally going to be a pirate fight. It's going to be the coolest. I know. I think I might be able to swing it though. And then what if we change the day? What was that? What if we change the day? I'll be gone for the entire week. So what if we change the day? <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, Katie and I are going to be out the 15th. Um, okay. that's going to be, uh, we're going to be in Orlando or in Florida, actually go and watch spaceships. So that's pretty rad. Awesome. So, that's cool. So it looks like, so next week you're out, Alyssa or which it, yes. Okay. So maybe the, well, we, then we'll all be here the eighth theoretically. I will be here. flying in then. So I might be, I might either be delayed or too tired to jump on, yeah. but I think I fly in at like six thirty PM. So it's rough. It's rough. Maybe we could push that day to that Wednesday instead. I mean, that I, works. Mean I guess we can do everything for you. Mm-hmm. I will. <laughs> Thanks, Katie. <laughs> me too. Me, 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 me. Too late, Rick. <laughs> Was it fast enough? Just sounded uh, like bandwagon. But there's a good chance I can get to the mainland on Tuesday, next Tuesday. I'll just have to. To the mainland. mainland. That's I know, right? Um, we have just left the mainland. Okay, we're pirates now. Oh, uh, I will actually have to take a boat to get to internet. <laughs> that's amazing. That's, that's, pretty, that's pretty awesome. Mm. What are you, what are you boat, going I mean, like a little for? motorboat. Where are you going? Can we ask? I'm going to Muskoka. <laughs> Doesn't sound like real. That sounds like a kind of licorice. Like, ooh, try the Muskoka. It's really. Can harsh. I get a quarter pound of Muskoka? <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, well, yes, we have yes. some Tuskegee. <laughs> Yeah, so Within so the- and like we we have to like row places. It's crazy. It's like is this voluntary? Yeah, I'm gonna go see my grandparents. Oh, okay. I used to go there every other summer and participate in like this regatta. Oh, and, are you and... are you doing that? Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, you, meant, you mentioned you that. It. Yeah, that is very cool. <laughs> I just want to yeah. I want to mention real quick. I'm we really raised three hundred sixty-seven dollars and twenty-three cents tonight for Extra Life. So thank you so much, everyone wow. who contributed. Awesome guys, uh, including wow. a, a Saxman uh, Saxman Mike threw in fifty bucks, but then on top of that, he threw in a twenty-five dollar recurring donation for two years. Oh so my gosh, that's, that's another eight hundred wow, over really? over uh, the next. Or wait, is that right? Twenty. What's twenty-four divided by four? Is eight? Right? Uh, no, six. Six hundred. Six hundred dollars over the next uh, two years. So that's badass. That's phenomenal. Mm-hmm. How generous! That's awesome. Super, Thank super you. kick-ass. Um, before everyone uh, in the chat leaves, I, I did want to say that as much as I've been trying to avoid it, um, my birthday is this Friday, and <gasps> what? I'm going to be having a birthday stream yeah, in the that's afternoon. That's awesome. So it'll probably be like five or six, probably like six. Sure. Happy yes. So Happy that's. Birthday. This Friday. I don't know. Awesome. I don't know what you're whispering about. <laughs> We're trying to be creepy about this. What is, what's a birthday stream? Oh, basically just stream on my birthday. We're just gonna do whatever Katie wants to do. Oh, happy birthday. Whatever I wanna do. Happy birthday. <laughs> anyway. Oddly creepy. I am getting old. State fan says Katie is getting old. Oh, state fan. Yep. <laughs> We're old. We're so, old. so old. Yeah. <laughs> Did you have not have that above Eric before? Well, it, when we moved from uh, small to big, there you go, oh. Eric. I, I put a, I put you on the helm of the oh. boat now. Yes, it actually I looks pretty it. awesome. Like you should, you should legit face your green I've, screen for a second. I've, I've got. Uh, wait, what? Hold on, let me. I want to see. What, okay. I want to see what I look like. For, I enjoy just like setting the scene ah, wherever ah. you are. Works out really you have well. To, 
<laughs> that's amazing. Wow, that's... Oh. oh, it went out of focus. Oh. There it is. There we go. That's awesome. We that was very that. cool. Excellent. Nice. Guys, yeah, I think I'm going to keep awesome. going because this is like the one of the first times we act. Fine, yeah, Rick. Awesome. I guess we'll see you in Seattle. What? I guess we'll see you in Seattle. We'll see you in Seattle for PAX totally. West. Totally. 2017 <laughs> amateur I'll hour. Look, I'll look into it. I'll look into it. Yeah. yeah. It's like you, you would look into RTX. Content. How was your one meeting you had that you couldn't come? He's, he explained. Oh, shit. Oh, my gosh. Awesome. Please tell me it was, like, postponed or something. I know, right? It was just an example. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, look into, I'll look into PAX. Um, yeah, what and you uh, come to my panel. Apparently, I got invited to be on a panel. Ooh. Oh, that's panel. exciting. What's your panel? Um, it's a panel with um, some friends that are also GMs that do streams. Um, Tyler Carpenter from H Hyper RPG, Lauren Bond, The Strix, uh, I think uh, The Brown Girl, uh, some other um, people. Wait, what did you just say? Did you say The Brown Girl? Yeah, that's her, that's her handle, isn't it? Who's? I can't remember. Okay, the brown girls. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna... I was like, "That's a, that's." A, I've never heard someone just. <laughs> I mean, that makes I mean, Ray. I, Ray was one... brown man. Yeah, I worked with a guy named know. Brown Man. That was his nickname he went by. So, yeah, super racist. But I mean, that's it's cool. Whatever. <laughs> that that's like? awesome. When is it? Um. Oh, I guess the bronze girl, not brown. Bronze. Bronze, bronze girl. girl. There we go. Made yeah, it made, made a little. I better. guess the schedule hasn't been released yet, but yeah, you'll have uh, to let us know. It's Sunday at three o'clock in the Sandworm. Okay. Cool. What? And I've got. I'm on the Rooster Teeth panel on Friday, and then I might. Me too. I may be hosting a Far Cry panel on Saturday. Rad. Yeah. And then Thanks we have you. we have Akin Con Sunday. Kick ass. See, these are plugs. Good work. <laughs> we finally right, figured work. it out. Like we could all do plugs at the so end. So find us at PaxWest. Dot net. Can you move people around in, this, in uh in whatever this program is? What what program is this called? Are we talking about Vroom? Yeah. Zoom. Zoom. Oh, Zoom. Like, can you order people? Like, if I I can put someone in a certain spot. Oh, that would be cool. I am maybe. I can pin a video. Okay, I'm actually gonna go now. You know, say we, we do because we can do like an overlay where it has like everyone's information. Like here you go, here's like everyone who wants to. Oh, like oh, that would be cool. Yeah, Thanks. see, Dick. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> told. I was trying to be helpful and give you some Twitter followers and get people on your Patreon, which is at oh, patreon.com/slash. Rick Lacey. Kind of funny. <laughs> All right, you guys. Oh, actually, now that begs up a question: What is the night bop? I saw it on your stream. What? Nightbot. Nightbot. Night, oh, Nightbot, Nightbot is a it's a, a like a moderation bot. So like it does some default things. So like certain words, if they pop up in chat, the robot will immediately catch it and erase it and stuff, and it can ban people. Oh, because it keeps putting. It does a thing where it 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 posts all of our links. Oh yeah, yeah. No, you can you can set. It's basically just a it's just a it's just a programmed uh thing that responds to certain things. So you can do commands where like pop up with information and things. So, so they'll say oh, like okay. Rick's social and then all your social media will come Whenever up. it pops up when it gives it gives a chunk it gives a block of everyone's links. It's just my portfolio and like I don't do anything with my portfolio. That's just for business. Oh okay. Yeah we'll, we'll get them to put it on your Patreon. Know. So Kasavar you're probably listening right now. That or Twitter. That or my Twitter because my Twitter's where my news is at. There you go. Or both. Or both. Cool. Anyway, I just saw that. All right, absolutely. I'm just really, I'm just really happy that 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 I get to play with you guys. Oh, I'm happy too. I'm glad that we got to do it again. I'm glad you got your yeah, book you too. I was best. nervous. Katie said you didn't get it, and I was like, oh crap. Well, I said no, it was it, delivered, it, and you went, oh, oh yeah. I didn't check my mail that day. <laughs> you know what it is? You know what it is? My mailbox is literally a whole block away. Oh, our the building is huge, and our apartment is the farthest apartment from the mailbox. So when you don't go out and get the mail that day, you're just like, oh, I'm not going out to get the mail. <laughs> and I forgot like Friday, Saturday, and picked it all up on Sunday. Nice. I just need to post pictures from from RTX. Oh, and then yeah. What I was gonna do is just throw your face in there. Mine, just like. Photoshopped. Oh, yeah, that, that's right. Well, paints actually. I need to get the. <laughs> I need to get the pictures from you too. Yeah. Pictures, please. Mm -hmm. Pictures. Sorry, please. sorry. I Wait, see what? Anything. I see anything. 
Huh? Pick, From RTX. Yeah, what? I didn't post anything. Except for that one picture I, that we took of Eric. Maybe Eric <laughs> posted that. <laughs> Which on, on the, in the tube? No, on the couch. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. I don't even know if I saw that one. With my... Good thing. <laughs> amazing <laughs> calendar. That's all I'm going to show you. With your calendar? You got to keep it safe for work. Safe <laughs> yeah, for families. Yeah, I think... I wonder if you opened it if we would get shut down. Well, there's only one real rough one. Wait, yeah. is that new? For is it? Alyssa, it is, yeah. <laughs> Wait, why, are, why can't we show it on the internet? It's got boobs in it. It's got a high nipple rate. Oh, cool. High yeah. nipple rate. It actually says that a, a high nipple rate in the corner. Is it like a red band calendar? I suddenly want to buy yeah. Alyssa lots of just pornographic video game things. And it's like every, like, here you go. I found that I was thinking of you. And I got this for it. It's like the it's it's the Grand Theft Auto calendar and it's just like dildos everywhere. Yeah. It's just like Alyssa's apartment's gonna be like a mechanic's garage, just like full of really I only put it I only put it up in my cubicle at work whenever you're there. So I'm just like shit, Jack's coming, gotta put up all my gifts. In a, really a box like these open put it all out. Anyway. It's like, oh my god, you have a friend over. <laughs> State fan said Alyssa HR loves her nightmare. nipples. <laughs> I'm going to go. I'm going to go. On that, note, on that note. Anyway. Bye, bye, guys. Bye, Rick. Bye. bye. See you guys later. <laughs> on that note. All right. Let's get out of here. Bye, bye. everybody. Bye. Thanks for watching, everybody. Thanks. And thanks for all the donations. It's super. Yeah, that was awesome. All right. Cool. Thanks. Yeah, Love you guys. See you guys later. See you soon. Bye. 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 All right. Excellent. Wow. Well, that was a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Did you have a good time, Katie? I had... A very good time. Did you have the best of times? And the worst of times. Well, that's but no, that's, not really the worst. No, of those times. are all good times. We, we this is great. I, I love this. This makes this is a lot of fun to just uh, raise money for extra life instead of getting bits on on D and D games. So mm -hmm. I feel cool about that. I think that went really really well. And hopefully, um, I will figure out what the hell is going on with the Twitch alerts that they're not popping up. Um, yeah, so I'm going to ping like Streamlabs and stuff and see if I can figure out what's going on. So anyway, um, fun times. Hey, thank you very much. Suddenly, Sky Factory 3 stream. Ah. <laughs> Do it. Feel the crux. What? What time is it? I mean, I could. I could. Do you want me to? I mean, you can. I don't want you to die, though. What if we did like maybe like an hour? You can do if you think you can do just an hour. Uh, it's 11 right now. It's 1110 right now. If at 1215, I'm not downstairs, you come yell at me. Okay, oh, can I have a hug? Is that okay? Mm -hmm. All right. Wait, will, uh, will you get your back? <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, Katie's. Oh God! Oh, oh, she's attacking. She's attacking. I couldn't attack it. Oh, here goes Emma. Oh, oh God, Emma's also attacking. Emma's also attacking. Uh, see you fun tonight. All right. I'm so tired from school. No, you poor thing. You're almost done. She's only got a couple more weeks left of school, and then she's a scientist. I wish. Oh, so, only an Emma. Then <laughs> she's just waiting. She's like, at some point, someone will love on me too. Okay. Emma. Emma. What? <laughs> what are you doing, Emma? Come here. Come here. <laughs> it's okay. Emma, you want to say anything to the people? <laughs> Did you just lick it? Did you just lick the microphone? It's okay. I'll move this. No, no, no. Oh, she's I'll, terrified I'll of the this. keyboard. Here, I moved it. I moved it. Come back. No, Emma, come back. I moved it. Come moved here, it. Emma. Emma. Come here. Emma. There you go. Ah. Uh, uh, think of it this way, Katie. The few days before graduation just drag on. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Emma. Emma, look. Ah. <laughs> uh. This is as far as I'll go. Hi. How are you doing, Miss Emma? He's so happy. You're so happy. Why are you there such you a happy go. dog? She's okay. such a happy oh. dog. She's down. All right. All right. You play Sky Factory. I'll play a little bit. Uh, I'm going to get my loving. Excuse me. Okay. Uh, uh, all right. Mm, love. Love. Much love. Are you saying <laughs> that uh, Ben still? Where, uh, yeah, which why he marries a woman and he doesn't love her, and so he says, like, I love you, and he goes, I love, 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 love. 
That's how I feel about you. Oh. <laughs> I'm just Wait, what? <laughs> That's bad. Uh -huh. yeah. I love you. Claybear Gaming. Wow, it's been what? one whole year already. Thank you very much, Claybear. <laughs> Katie's hit me in the mouth. She's so sorry. Emma, take your bone. Take your bone. All right, I'll set up the green screen and everything. Or thing. What's she doing? Emma, no. You are dope. Oh, my. my. There. This will go here. Don't worry, I'm just setting up for for uh, Sky Factory. It's loading currently. We're gonna play for about an hour, and I'll figure out what the hell we're gonna do. What you doing, Kate? I'm looking at that. Jack and Katie are absolute relationship. Oh, that's sweet. Oh. You gotta see how like the sausage is made behind the scenes. <laughs> Look, I'm holding. Oh no, the green screen's out. <laughs> Soul says Katie's cutting into our Sky Factory time. All right. Uh. Uh. Did you see? Katie said. That. All right. Good times in the city. So we're gonna play some, uh, we're gonna do this, that. Uh, yeah, we're gonna play some Sky Factory. All right. Ba -ba. <laughs> I love this. I'll get out of your way. Yeah, the green screen, uh, he also, he also put it a, a bit further back than we yeah, normally I'll have move it. Yeah, I'll move it forward here in a second once uh, I get out of the way. Once Katie... Ow! Hi, Kuse. Once How are you I doing? out of the way. I think it might actually be slightly delusional. Whoa! Oh, oh right that was incredibly dangerous. Katie had an open bottle of water, almost knocked it over. Is it good? Okay. Is that fine? Yeah, it's fine there. I'm going to use that one, so... Oh? Kuse, why are you more wet? Are you just dunking your head in water and then coming up here? I all right. Oh, you didn't put your cards in your book. That's okay. All right. I'm going to move your chair so I can get more space. Can you say, have, jump? Are you going to bring your ball? Yes, I will. Harmless. All right. All right. Doing this. Cash bin is... Hello, Ellie. Okay. I love you. I'm gonna play some video games. I'm gonna play some Sky Factory. I'll make friends. I'll tell everyone about your birthday stream. Are you doing your channel? All right. Okay. This guy moves forward. All right. That's all right. Do this. Hey, Mount Belly! Thank you so much, Mount Belly. Huh. Or MT Belly. Do that, and then one last thing. Yes. Sorry. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, thank you. All right, Katie reminded me to tweet about playing Sky Factory. Uh. Bring this guy down. Okay, we're just about ready to go, everyone. Thank you so much for hanging out. Ugh. Okay, let's do this. We're going to play some Sky Factory, Warden Skytopia. Um, tweet. And then we'll get this party rocking. All right, let your friends know that we're playing Sky Factory now. <sighs> okay, so here we are. Look at this. We're back. We're in Sky Factory. Everything is good. Um, we got our uh, we got a lot of prosperity shards now. 
we got our uh, redstone growth happening here. So I got to figure out a way to automate that a little bit better or get more of them, I should say. Uh, the Big Tuna, the Big Tuna. Thank you very much, Big Tuna. Appreciate you. Uh, you brand new warden, really? Hey, big uh, brand new warden, Twitch Prime warden. Thank you so much. By the power of the beer, we are upon it. I appreciate you. You're good people. Big Tuna. Hey, Big Tuna. All right, I'll tell you what I want to do. I want to do um, right now. Oh, what is that? That's fertilized essence. That's kind of cool. Um, I got enough. Oh, I got you. You can go there. Oh, I got a full stack of redstone. Hell yeah. Who is that? Mogwai Hunter. Pick the perfect night to watch my first stream of yours. Thank you very much, Mogwai Hunter. I appreciate you. I'm glad you had a good time. Um, yeah, tonight was a lot of fun. Um, I got snow. That's interesting. Uh, what can I drop? I'll just put this over here. Oh, put that over there as well. Uh, there we go. And so, um, anyway, yeah. So, uh, right now I've been working on my... Um, my world here for a little while. Um, it's going pretty well. Uh, those of you who've been hanging around for a bit, you know you've seen what's going on. You've seen how it's been progressing. Pretty happy with it. Um, I so uh, I'll tell you guys a secret. If you promise not to tell anybody else, uh, we uh, we may have filmed some more uh, Sky Factory at Achievement Hunter today. And I did something new that is super awesome. Um, I need Ender Pearls though. I got one there. I need more Ender Pearls. Um, I want to say I had a few more downstairs. Let me check. And I also need I need that string. Do I have lots of string? I don't have much string. Oh, I have string there. Okay, good. So I need lots of... Uh, where did I put the string? Uh, what? Sort. Okay, I'll do this. I need lots of uh, wool. Do that. Uh... That ought to be good. Yes. Because what I can do... Let me go grab another Ender Pearl. Uh, something really cool. Uh, da it's a uh, tummy. Uh, yep. Yeah. Oh, I got an Ender Enderman right there. Nice. Put you here. Bum, bum, bada. Speaking... Come here. Come here. Hey, I'm looking at you. Oh, yep. Oh, it's raining now, too. That sucks to be you, buddy. Oh. Ow. Come on. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Ow. Where'd... where'd... Wow, he almost killed me. Um, he died somewhere. <laughs> Alright. That's looking good. We have a lot of stuff in here. A lot of stuff on our chests. So I got a Void Crystal hoe. That's pretty interesting. Uh, more spikes. All right, how many pearls have we got? We got seven. Perfect. Okay, I'm going to grab a couple. How are we doing on these? I got four legendary loot bags. Um, oh, this got mucked up again. Dang it. Uh, it's a bit of a resource drain, but looking to make an environment control. You can outfit it with no teleport module that prevent intermin from running away from your grinder. Oh, that's kind of cool. I dig that. Um, I'm going to do this. Uh, wait, okay, so I need to go there. Boom. Okay, that fixed it. Every now and then, for some reason, um, it gets caught up where it, it puts the blues in there. Actually, you know what? Maybe I can do... I'll put you in there, too. And you in there, too. Okay, now we're good. And you go in there. All right, so I'm going to show you guys something pretty cool. Nom, 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 nom. Scared the hell out of me. <laughs> Started nomming. All right, so what I can do with eight wool and an ender pearl is make an elevator so I can make two of them I got two elevators here so check this out this is pretty damn sick so um, let's go ahead and put that away so uh, right here let's go out a little bit more so okay we know that's the edge so let's let's rework this a little bit do I have any right, I got a few um, so, what I'm going to do, go two, so two, uh, right, okay, so there's the edge, two, three, four, five, six, there's the center, so this is dead center. Thunder! Oh, it's really dark under there. How many torches? Okay, there we go. Uh-huh. 
All right, so this is center. So, uh, and then that's the outside. So one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six. So this is dead center of our platform here. Uh, okay, so we'll, I don't know if I'm gonna put it, I guess for that one, that's fine. Uh, we'll, put center, no. we'll, we'll put it right here. Okay, check this out. So knock this guy out. And then I'm going to put, all right, center, put right there. So now, if I go up, and so I'm going to go one, two, three to the right, and one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so just, just, okay, so check this out. Let's see if this works. Let's see if this works. I'm super excited if it works. Jack, Minecraft and rain sounds. Clearly, I'm in heaven. Aw, gamer culture. I appreciate that. Um... Yeah, dude, I freaking love, I love playing this. It's so much fun. Incredible thoughts. Incre Ooh, that's frightening. So overwhelmed. How did my brain conceive them? All right, so it's right here. So check this out. So I'm standing on top here. Womp, I'm down at the basement. Save myself a lot of walking. And then over here. And then I'm like, oh, I want to go back up. Whoop, I'm back up top. Oh, that saves so much. That saves so much time. So much time and preparation. I love it. That's pretty sweet. Also, Kasvar's freaking out because he says uh, so he just fixed the server. So when we play tomorrow night, we're going to do some Warden Wednesday tomorrow night with our, uh, our Sky Factory server. And it looks like Kasvar may have solved it. He may have fixed it. Which is pretty damn rad. All right, so let's do this. Let's. Oh, I got plenty of stirs. Uh -huh, I'm so overwhelmed. How did my brain conceive them? Okay, let's put these down. Cause. Bunk, 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 bunk. What the? Bunk and bunk. There we go. All right, so now we got ourselves a nice stairwell. Uh, Shadow Lord, thank you very much, Shadow Lord. Brand new warden, thank you so much, Shadow Lord. Twitch Prime Warden, by the power of the beer, we are bonded. Thank you very much. I appreciate you. You're good people. I've heard nothing but good things about you, Shadow Lord. So, all right, so we got this now. So we have ourselves a nice little teleporter to get up and down. So we can get down here, check all this stuff. Um, oh, that's beautiful. Is this getting stuck in? So how do I prevent this from happening? Where... It's compacting the green one first. So like, if I do that, see now it's fine. And then I put this here. But it, it keeps grabbing that, and if a green goes in before a white, then uh, it freaks out everything. So I'm just not sure how that'll happen, how, how to do that, how to fix that. Um, uh, RD Link says, your SpaceX NASA news is pretty awesome. It is pretty badass. I'm very happy. Mr. Heppers, Mr. Heppers, welcome to the Warden's Sploosh. I was, you didn't splash as much as I thought. By the power of the beer, we are bonded. Welcome. Brand new Warden. I'm happy to have you here. Thank you so much for coming out. You are good people. All right, so let's, um, let's do this. Okay, so I want to do, do some auto sieving. Um, I think that's one thing I need to start working on. Uh, the piping and whatnot, we'll, we'll get to that later. I'm just going to put that there for no reason. Um... Don't worry, I'll make more elevators. We'll, we'll have a whole series of elevators. That'll be super, super rad. Um, also, I can make more of these guys. Make more redstone things. Uh, mechanical users, because I need... Uh, mechanical user... Do I need... So I just need redstone, cobblestone, and then... A bunch of those, all right. I got plenty of uh, redstone here, so let's... Let's make some more mechanical users while we're at it, while I'm thinking about it, because I want to get eight. All right, so this guy. Oh, where's my in ender pearl shard? I think I left it over here. Um, nope, not in there. And there it is. Okay. All right, do that. Come over. Yeah. And then we're going to say uh, one of this guy. So that's... And one, two, three. We'll put, make three for now. Uh, that. Three of you guys. 
And then we need uh, droppers. So, do that. Where's the rest of my cobble? Oh, there we go. No, one, two, three. And then we just need some levers. This inventory's too far. Come on. Uh, you. There we go. All right, so. And sticks. Oh, all the way around. Who is that? I thought I was going to bed early tonight, but I can't resist watching. I know that feeling. It's, uh, thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate it. Appreciate you guys are hanging out and watching me play some, uh, some Sky Factory. It means the world to me. All right, let's make these guys. So we got enough to do that and then that and you guys. We got three more mechanical users. Super, super rad. Okay, so now... Uh, I got dirt. I'll put two dirts down. Oh, uh, dirt. And then uh, we'll say we'll put it on. Put it on this side. Put them both. All right. Oh yeah. We'll do over here. Dirt. And then we're gonna pull them. We'll put a mechanical user here. Mechanical user here. I'm gonna say uh, activate item. With block the item. Uh, I can walk with the item, and now we need to make some plants. Which I, I need uh, more of this. I that. And I need you guys. So, uh, I need seeds. Crap, I need seeds. Regular seeds. Uh, do I have regular seeds anywhere? I also need a bunch of these guys. Alright, so. I may have to go get some seeds. Hang on one second. Just regular seeds. Hello, sheepy the sheep. Oh, there's... I'm getting a bunch of different kinds of seeds. I just want regular seeds. I think that was regular seeds. Do I have some? Oh, I'm full of stuff. Okay. I think that's what I want right there. Um... Why do I have a white loot bag? Uh, poop. I'll drop the poop. Seeds. Okay, there we go. I need... Let's let's go and do this so we can see if we get more. Uh -huh. Don't worry. I'll put some more grass down here in a minute. Uh, regular seeds. Do I have no regular seeds, really? Just got the one... How many bones? I know. Okay, well, I'll come back here in a minute. You guys hang out. I'll be back. Oh, there we go. Do, 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 do. Uh, really, uh, Xena, I'm really sad to hear that. I, I, I hope uh, the, the dumb stuff we get to do tonight maybe will, uh, will help you out a little bit. Maybe take your mind off things. Uh, all right. I have lots of that stuff. Okay, so silicon egg. And then I needed bone meal. I've got so much weird stuff on me right now. This is odd. Let me just open these guys just to get them out of my... All right, we got packing tape and rotten flesh. Don't know what packing tape does, but sure. And then we got lead and a black quartz pickaxe. Ooh, that's kind of neat. And lead. Or, oh, it's a lead. <laughs> Yep, sure, Jack. All right, let's uh, let's torch some of this stuff. We don't need that. Um, one potato. All right, snow. I don't know why. I, I'll hold on to snow just to be safe. I've got a feeling I may need it at some point. All right, let me put some of this stuff up. Um, draconium ingot will go there. Lead ingot there. Ancient spores, lead ore. Why are those in there? Ancient spores. Okay. Uh, to do redstone, copper, iron. I'm gonna throw some of this in here for now. Do that. Okay. Put you in there. Oh, that's snow. Wrong one. Wrong one. Iron. There we go. Um, yeah, we'll put snow in there too. Why not? Sure. Um, to do. okay. I need to make, uh, how do I, I wonder if I can get seeds any other way. Like, if you can just make seeds. Wheat seed bag. You can sift seeds. Uh, string mesh with dirt. Oh, okay. So does dirt. I guess. Or cocoa beans with a mana pool? 
I've never messed with that stuff. That's kind of cool. Oh, okay. Or loot bags. It's white loot bags, I guess. All right, let's let's uh, let's go ahead and we're going to make some uh, redstone seeds. Uh, redstone seeds. So we need uh, first this guy. And then we're going to go back to, uh, let's see, here we go. One, two, three, four. That gets us our tier one. And then um, where is... Uh, where, okay, so seeds, and then go like that, enter medium. I need my infusion crystal. Where'd I put my infusion crystal? Do you, anybody see where I put my infusion crystal? Crikey. There it is. Uh, I'll pull the stack down too. Yeah, this guy factory got pretty big, Xena. It's, uh, it's pretty ridiculous how, uh, how nuts it's been. Um, been very fortunate with how it's all turned out. So let's do this. Let's, let's, let's do that. And then there, there, and there. All right. Um, we'll absolutely have Botanium mod, Mana Pools, Flower, Power, and Magic. Ooh, that sounds like fun. All right, so I need, I need four, so I need to get, uh, that's two, I need to get 16. Crap. Uh... 16. Uh, so I got four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. One. All right, that's 18. I, I can't math tonight. All right, so now we're going to go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and that's get 12 of those. I, I am just not mathing right today. All right, uh, tiny pile of redstone. Uh, redstone seeds. There we go. And oh, get tier three, tier two. Craggy, really? Did I not do tier two? I'm an idiot. All right. And do that. Now then, we'll do our tier two. Oh, and then you go there, tier two. Now we get up to tier three. Okay, and we need our seed. Do that, boom, we got redstone seeds. Easy as that, obviously. Did anyone count how much, uh, how much stuff I use there, so when I have to make it all again, I can just e easily have the correct amount. Let's see if I can get them all to grow. And also, if anyone figured out a way where I can just keep uh, watering like this, like if I gotta have a water bucket just holding right click, um, there is a graphic online someone did like a uh, like a growth. Um, They're like, oh look, this is what I use for my uh, for my farm, my auto farm, and they had a mechanical user with right click on a on a bucket. Doesn't work anymore. Um, they came out and said like, yeah, that straight up doesn't work. So um, anyway, if you know any way to do this without uh, having to uh, hold it down, that would be super super rad of you. Um, oh yeah, I was getting, I was going to go and uh, bone meal and see if I get more. I have bones and uh, bones, 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 bones. Oh, I got lots of bone meal. Save me the trouble. All right, let's get some more seeds. Seeds. Because I want to get eight of those in a circle where I don't ever have to worry again. What happened there? Uh, where I don't have to worry again about... Uh... There we go. That. All right, let's break some of you. Um, don't want to hit the chicken. Give me, give me some regular damn food. There we go. That's what I wanted. And of course, I can't pick them up. Uh, industrial hemp seeds. We'll drop that. Okay, so there we go. Let's try to get some more. Let's try to. Let's see if we can just get eight. Let's see if we can just make eight. So I had four. So I need to get two more. Let's do that once, and then we'll figure out the auto growing. Oh, there we go. There's three. I need one more. One more. Come on. One more. Uno mas. Uno mas. We got all those redstone seeds going. That'll be super rad. Anyone? Redstone. Redstone. Oh, these flowers are lovely, but don't need them. Uh huh. There we go. We got it. All right. So let's. Yeah, and there you go. There's some grass. Eat the grass, you guys. Okay. 
Um, you, why do you... Uh, <laughs> you need to do Sky Factory every night. It's so fucking amazing. Uh, Frips not. I appreciate that. I really do. Um, this game is addicting as hell. So, um, yeah. It's, uh, it's going to be the end of me, I think, at some point. I also need dirt. I'm running low on dirt. All right. So I need to... Nope. Wrong one. That's what I want to do. Uh, up and yep. Okay. Uh, I need two more dirt. Or no, I need one, two, th three more dirts and a bunch of uh, uh, seeds. Okay. Uh, how do I get my initial one? So we're going to go uh, to, to, to uh, these prosperity shards. So I need a bunch of those. So I got. Four and then one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay. Got our base seeds. Now let's bump these things up to tier one. Okay. Now let's uh, make some tier twos. So I need to get four for one of those, and then I need to get four of the next one. So, um, so that's. Four times four for each. So uh, let's math. Okay, that's. I need. Oh. Oh, nice. Oh, that's nice. Uh, Bernie gave me a really nice comment about uh about Tuesday night game fights. That's very very kind of him. All right, so I'm going to go. I had. I need four times four, so that's sixteen. But then on the next one, I need four of the next one as well. So that's uh, another 16 times four. So uh, 16 times four plus 16. So 64. So I need 80, 80 Inferium per seed, I think. So I've got lots and lots of it. Um, we'll see if that math checks out too. Okay, so I've got uh, 28. Let's do this. Okay, so there's 30. Um, well, let's do this. Okay, 64 plus another, what did I say, 16? So, um, oh, let's do this. Sky Factory's awesome. Jack, you're the best. Thank you very much. I really appreciate that. That is super, super kind of you. And uh, it means the world to me that you guys enjoy watching me play this this game. I am super addicted. Okay, and I'm going to put these four over here. So now we have just Inferium. We have 80. Let's see if that math checks out. All right, so... Um, Let's go ahead and do this. Uh, oh, and then there, there, and there. So how did that? Oh man, okay. There we go. All right. Uh, so there should be twenty on each, right? Oh, oh crikey! I just almost. All right. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. There. Now we're gonna get twenty prudentium. Before I go too far, I'm going to go ahead and bump this up to the next one. Uh, one, two, three, four. Remember, just making one right now because I want to see if that works out. Once you prudentium, that makes the tier threes, tier twos. Now we're going to put, now we need to get the prudentiums bumped up to tier. Um, all right, and then that will make four of these guys. And then I go four like that, and that will give us tier three. Crafting, and then I need um, seeds. Oh, I need four more of those. Damn, I was off. So 80 plus another uh, four times four, another 16. So I need 96 per crafting seed. Okay. So I need 96 Inferium per single redstone crafting seed. All right, well, we figured it out. We did the math. Hashtag, they did the math. Okay. So 96 Inferium per uh, per thingy. All right, good, good, good. We did the math. They did the monster math. <sighs> did I have any dirt laying around here? There's pods all. I don't know if I can grow stuff on pods all or if that's bad. All right, uh, do this. I have so much crap. Um, put you in there. Chicken manure. Sure, these carrots can go up there too. Bucket. Um, I have so many cocoa beans. Why do I have so many cocoa beans? Egg. Potato. All right. I guess I can find a potato at least. Potato. Okay. Um, let's go back down and grab more Inferium Essence. We have 
bucket loads downstairs. I can take my elevator. You guys ready for this? Whoosh. There's an Enderman right there. Get in your thing, jerk. Oh, this broke again. Right, hang on. There. That's bugging me that it's not working right. Oh. Alright, screw it. I'll hold on to this. Uh, if you can work out how to use... You can work out how to use garden cl clouches. That'll give you all the essence you'll ever need. Just what need water and power. Garden clouches. Sure. All right. All right. Um. Oh my God! I have so I have so much inferior essence. Okay. I have a lot of inferior essence now. Go away. Uh, make a drawer key to fix the drawer problem. It locks items. Okay, a drawer key. I, I will sort that out quite soon. I promise. And I also need to get another ender pearl so I can make another teleporter so I can just jump right up there. All right. Um, now we're going to make a boatload more. Oh, let me drink some of my melon juice. Bub, 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 bub. There we go. All right. So now. Let's do this. Let's make a boatload of, uh, do I have enough? Yeah. Let's make, let's make a stack of level two. And then, uh, all right, tier one. So now we go, all right, get three of those. Now then we got uh, plenty of this stuff. So let's go ahead and uh, one, two, three, four. Oh, let's, let's do this, do that. Oh, bink, and over up there. Okay, and put you in the middle. That was 13 of these guys. Uh, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, like that. All right, we got tier three crafting seeds. Now we need to get more. Uh, I need to get, what is that? A, a bunch more of those things. So let's do... Uh, yep, do that. Put that there. That. And put that there. There you go. Bunch of those. And then we go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and that. That gives us enough uh, for some of those. Uh -huh. ba -ba -ba. Ba -da -da. Ba -da -da -da. All right, let's hide you. Not enough. All right. Well, three more. That gives us eight. And with that, we can go and make one more <laughs> of those. Do I not? How, I need more. God, I need so much redstone or so many uh, inferior seeds. So, oh, I have enough. I thought I had enough for two. All right. Well, I have enough for one more, but I'm out of the the good stuff. I need to get more inferior, but I can go plant these guys. And I don't have. There's a squid. Just that's. Oh, give me a loot bag. Hey, slime ball and mini charcoal. Great. Leather boots. Let's, uh, and I don't need mini charcoal. I'll throw it in a burner. Why not? Mini, I don't like mini charcoal, uh, on like mini charcoal torches. That just bugs me. I don't know why. I don't know why I don't like it so much, but it just, it just, Irks me. Also, a lead or a lead. I don't know if I need a lead, but whatever. Okay, let's go grab some more inferior essence. Rips, <laughs> rip farm squid. Yep, we murdered the crap out of him. Ah, go away. Okay, that's oh Jesus. Oh, googly. That googs. Uh, B twelve in eleven. Woot! Thank you very much, B twelve. In eleven, or uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know what your name would be. Um, all right, we still got a lot. Oh, oh, I can't hold that much. Oh, great. Oh God. Oh, what have I done? What have I done? Um, will that pick it up? Oh crap! It's probably too much space. Oh, son of a gun! All right. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god damn it. Alright. 
Um, crap. All right. Um, what do I have on me? I have a basic drawer here. Okay. Um, uh, I'll put it on there. All right. So now, there we go. Will it also pump it into there? It'd be awesome if it also pumped it into there. Want to grab it? Cake. Cake. Oh, Jesus. All right. All right. That's. It won't pump it into there, will it? It's just going to pump it into this one? Um, no, pump it in there. You need a drawer controller for that. All right. Well, I'm close. I can't, like. I can't do, like, uh. Uh, crikey. This, can I? Um, like that? Will that work? Like if that one, if this one fills, it'll go into there. You can add another transfer pipe, yes. Like, will that work though? Or do I need to connect it directly to it? Yeah, that works too. That hammer does not like cake. He does not like cake. Oh yeah, it's raining. Hey, you want to mess with you want you want to play now, Enderman? Huh? Oh, you, you got dropped, Enderman. You don't mess with me when it's raining. Okay. Let's stop doing that. All right, let's get back up. So that elevator thing might be the coolest thing I've messed around with and got working properly. Makes me very happy. All right, um, now let's go ahead and do another just stack of uh, the level two stuff. I have two extras. All right, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, ten. There we go. All right, that ought to be plenty to make us. The rest of our seeds. Oh, I already have two. Okay. And then we got three. So now we have three more. So it'll be one, two, three. Okay, perfect. So now I just need to put this stuff back. We'll put our Inferium in there. And our other stuff. Put our Prosperity Shard. That thingy. We have our seeds. Uh, do you need uh, Do you need to be a warden to play in tomorrow's server? Um. So, yes. So we have Warden Wednesday... Um, basically is meant for uh, our wardens, our, our subscribers. Um, and also, honestly, because it's going to be a lot of people trying to get in, uh, I need to limit it in some form or fashion. So uh, making it where it's wardens only is going to be our best bet for now. Um, I may, I mean, depending on how things go, I maybe will open it in the future. Um, but right now, we're going to have to keep it just to wardens because uh, it's going to get out of control very quickly. And uh, I do appreciate it, and I love you guys, and it really means the world to me that you guys come out and watch this stuff. Um, just for uh, for sanity's sake, we're gonna have to keep it wardens only, at least for now. Um, watching these streams makes Jack my favorite achievement hunter because it shows his dedication to his work. Oh, thank you very much, man. I, I do appreciate that. All right, now let's do this. Get some wood chips. Get those wood chips. Like chips. And there we go. Okay. okay. Look at those chips. Get the chips, bruh. Okay, and let's put some chips down. I get some more dirt. I know I only need three, but might as well fill up the whole damn thing. There. Perfect. All right, we're gonna wait for this stuff to go. Um, get our sieving areas. How is the uh, SF server gonna work? By the way, it's gonna spawn everyone where you're slash at Jacks right now. No, big, uh, big black bears. So the way it's gonna work is tomorrow we're gonna have a brand new uh, clean server. So we're gonna start from scratch. Um, I know that sounds like a pain in the ass, but um, I just uh, I kind of want to keep this world sort of separate. Um, not because I don't love you guys, but just to uh, just kind of give 
the wardens uh, their own sort of uh, thing, like our own sort of uh, area, you know? So, uh, yeah, but it'll be fun. Don't worry. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah, that's all splashing all over down there. There we go. Okay. Uh, okay, and we're going to over those guys. One, two, three. And I need uh, th three, four more mechanical users. Creative prop. Thank you very much, creative prop. Um, wow, thank you very much, creative prop. That is super awesome of you. By the power of the beer, we are bonded. Welcome to the uh, the warden's creative prop. You are good people. All right, redstone. Got lots of redstone here. Let's make some more mechanical users. I need uh, one, two, three, four more mechanical users. Now I'm going. Okay. Okay. Uh, Glacierus. Thank you very much, Glacierus. I appreciate you. Glacierus, 14 months in a row. Thank you so much, Glacierus. By the power of the beer, we are bonded. That is super rad of you. Mechanical user. Let's make, what did I say, four of these guys? Oh, I'm going to need another Ender Shard, aren't I? Uh-huh. Oh, where's my Ender Shards? There they are. I'm going to have to make more. And is the glass thing? Where is that? To make inner shards, you have to break them with something. Uh, I don't have it on me. Who is that? Ad Adulation. Thank you very much, Adulation. Five months in a row for Adulation. Thank you very, very much for that, Adulation. Uh, where is it? I know I have it here somewhere. Uh, uh, in there. Does anyone remember where I put my, uh, like, shard breaker thingy? All right. So Kasavari and Chris right now are testing the, uh, the thing. All right, so Ender Shards. All right, Ender Shards. How do I make them? I need a glass cutter. Three silver. Do I have three silver? Yeah. Okay. Let's do that, and we'll go make one of these, because I don't know where the other one is. All right. More of those. I'll put you in here. Live there forever now. Okay, now uh, we need to do a thing. Uh, T-Man, thank you very much, T-Man. Brand new warden, thank you very much, T-Man. By the power of the beer, we are bonded. You are good people. Mechanical user, we're going to make four more of these guys. So let's do this. We're going to do, uh, we got one, two, three, four. Okay, and then I need my redstone. Uh, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Do that, and now we need uh, our dropper, which is a bunch of cobblestone. Do that, and then we say one, two, three, four. Beautiful, and now we just need a lever. What? All right, do that. Oh, I keep getting them backwards. One, two, three, four. All right. Be there, be there. Mechanical user. Put them all right on top of each other. Boom. Four mechanical users. We got plenty now. We're going to have a fully automated area. It's going to look super gross, but don't worry. I will fix it in the future. You know me. I'm good for that stuff. All right. So we're going to go one, two, three, and four. And we're going to do activate item click. Button click. Click. But I'm going to click. All right, there we go. So now, theoretically, if we just drop... Like, I'm actually watering right now. I don't think you, you can't tell because it's raining. But I am watering, so things are moving faster than normal. Um, yeah, so there is a way to... Um, eventually, we'll put, like, the chest right above the water. That one went. The upper right. Let's see if they all go. So we got... So number three... And then, I don't know if it's going to go faster because it's raining. All right. Come on. Yeah, I think the rain is actually ruining us. There's number two. I just went. All right. All right. Come on, everybody. All he, need, all he needs is a worm. Yes, if I found a worm, that'd be great. I know this get, you're literally watching plants grow. That's, this is going to be fascinating. There's number uh, five. So two, three, and five have all gone. 
Oh. This one hasn't gone at all yet. Come on, buddy. What's wrong with you? Bro, bro, look the one. I'll be watching you, Jack. Still, I'm just, I'll be playing Brink. Okay, that's fine. Play Brink all you want. I'm not going to stop you. There it goes. All right. Yep, there goes that guy. Okay, that one popped. Good, good, good. This one just seems to give me trouble. All right, let's let's assume they're all working. So now that's going to put everything into this chest here. We got eight redstone essence. Perfect. Let's get one more. We make more. Joshua, thank you very much, Joshua. Brand new warden, Joshua. Um, Joshua 9067, thank you very much. By the power of the beer, we are bonded. You're good people. Thank you very much, Joshua. All right, and there goes the last one. Perfect. Okay, so now we got nine. We'll take our nine over to Nya. And then do this. And that makes 16 redstone. That's awesome. So that means uh, almost every time. Cotton seeds. I'll put that in there too. Uh, that means almost every single time the eight of these pop, we're going to get 16 redstone. So that's pretty badass. So. Um, that's about as automated as I can get right now. Why did I do two of these? I did not. I'm an idiot. I just realized those both already had. I made two more extra mechanical users. I don't need the extra two because I got three, three, and then two on the sides. So I'm dumb, dumb. Oh, well. Um, that can stay in there for now. I'll pull the little bit down. All right. Kick-ass. Okay. Fort kick-ass is looking mighty, mighty fine. Um, let's put some... I don't need to eat it at all. All right. Um, what are we going to do now? We got that going. I want to look into um, auto. I want to look into auto hammers. Uh, weighted, weighted pressure plate. Wait, is that really it? Just a diamond hammer. Is this it? Because I, I could have been making this a long time ago. But you need power for this, right? Um, the auto hammer needs power. And that's where I don't, I'm not sure exactly how to work. Uh, Fort, this is Fort Kick-Ass. Thank you very much. Um, should I do that or should I do the, the pumping thing to get all the stuff from up from downstairs? Auto hammer needs RF. Okay. Mag, magmatic generator. Make a magmatic, magmatic, blah, 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 blah. All right, let's, all right, generator. Coal generator, oil, leaf eating generator, flux generator, um, sterling generator. I suggest water wheels for power. Ooh, water wheels. Does that work? Is that a thing? It's totally a thing. Burn time, water wheel segment. I need steel. I have no steel. Solar panels are used for power. Learn from Ryan. Go with magmatics. Okay. Magmatic. Okay. Magmatic generator. So I need gold, a furnace generator, which is a furnace and a machine block. Okay, I think I have all this stuff. So let's... So what do you put in the magmatic generator? Is it cobblestone? Okay, so let's just kind of work our way down. Let me, let me clear out some space in my inventory just so I can kind of see things. Um, I'll put you in there. I'll hold out the iron. Iron leggings, I think I can break down and actually just get iron out of it. Um, slime ball can live up there. Trees, packing tape and the lead. Silicon, we'll put next to you. Um, transfer pipes, hold on to. Dirt, I'll put up there. Uh, there's a diamond hammer, and then there's mechanical user. I'll actually put that with the farm. Stone, uh, trans I'll put that over there. This stuff, I'll hold on to for later. And uh, that's a chicken nest thing. Um, all right, so this wrench can go up here. And a diamond wand will hold on to you because I might need stuff for sieving. Okay, so let me... Can't eat my apple yet. All right. Um, can I cook that? No. There's a way to break down iron leggings, right? Oh, well. Screw it. All right. Uh, let's put them in here for now. Okay, so let's work our way through... The magmatic generator. So five gold ingots, ingots, a bucket of lava. Of course, I just put my bucket away. Um, I'll grab one bucket and go get some lava. 
Okay, let's grab the lava bucket. Okay, so I got a bucket of lava. And then we've got... Was it five ingots? Yep, five ingots. Two redstone. Um, there's one. I got plenty of redstone, though. I'm gonna get off of lava before I burn myself. Um, and then we go two redstone. Uh, I was gonna put something in there, I thought. Forget what it was. Uh, put undamaged metal armor in the smeltery to break them down, I think. Oh, okay, cool. Do I still have it on me? Where'd I put it? Where'd I put those pants? Um, I just had them on me. Where, where did I put those pants? What is that? Silkworm. There they are. Okay, let's, let's see if that works. Let's see if I can put it in the smeltery. And, ah, it totally works. They're cooking. I'm oh, perfect. Okay. Oh. Oh wait, oh. Oh, 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 oh man, put my, my tinkerers thing in there. I need to make more basins too. Um, we'll work with that later. All right, so now, okay, we've got all of that. So we've got our lava. Um, okay, so we just need a furnace generator, which I need a lot of iron and a machine block, two more redstone. Uh, let's go ahead and make a furnace. We can make one of those right now. Uh, furnace. Okay. Okay, furnace, two redstone. I need five more iron ingots. I need nine more iron ingots and four redstone. Nine iron ingots and four redstone. So I need four more redstone. One, two, three, four. And I gotta do some iron. Do, 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 do. Ba -da, ba -da. Right, there we go. Okay, there's nine iron I just grabbed. Let's do this. Okay, so now we've got this guy, um, all right, machine block, need a chest, need a chest, I got plenty of chests, okay, there we go, that makes four, don't need four, but what, Herber, and then that guy, and two more redstone, <laughs> glad I have a, a lot of redstone now, okay, and I think, We've got ourselves a mag. Oh, cool! I got to keep my bucket. A magmatic generator. So now then, we have a magmatic generator. I'm going to, I'm going to beat this uh, out this direction, and uh, and extend this platform out. Um, lots of wood. Uh huh. And we'll say you. All right, I don't, that's not gonna be enough, but that's a lot. Do I have more wood in here? I got jungle wood. I really need to get make some kind of wood generator. Uh, I recommend setting up your power on level below. It gives you more room to work. Should I do it below and just kind of work my way up with it? And like, I do have, I mean, I've got this whole area right here, but the, all the power, see this was gonna be the area for the, um, the items, but you know what? I mean, really, I could pump the items over to here, into this area. Like, I could literally come down. This could be all my items, and this could be all my uh, all my energy and stuff, all my power down here, and just pump it up. And then I can literally run that pipe down and over to that side. So yeah, let's do that. Let's put. Okay, so we're going to um, we're going to put it all in here. So um, let's start. Perhaps we'd better start from the beginning. Um, make sure you use a liquid transfer node to suck out the lava. Okay. <sighs> Earlier today, my sis asked me when will Rogue two, Rogue One Two come out. I don't remember how Rogue One ended. Ooh, that's that's rough. That's a disappointing way to spend your night. All right, so now we're gonna put this there. Now I need to put. Uh, I'm guessing lava needs to go in here, right? So, um, use the areas of your old spawner. Use the area of your old spawner over that out there. That's. Well, I want to keep it all kind of close together, though. Oh, I mean, damn it. I totally could. I could break all that stuff down and put it out there, all my electronic stuff way out in the distance. Uh, all right, screw it. Let's, let's keep it low, because I, I want to keep it clear. I, don't, I want the top level to look pretty, and so I think a lot of mechanic stuff we'll put underneath. Eventually, we'll move all this underground, too. So, all right. That's what we'll do. We'll move all that underground later. Um, where's my glowstone dust? I want to make some uh, bricks. Is it just four? 
Oh, oh yeah, it was four. And then do that. I'll save some more for later. And now that I'm thinking of it, I just want to go do this. That one we did. And we'll put this here too, just to sort of make it look nicer. And we'll do this downstairs as well. All right, uh, you can make another crucible. What? Yes. Okay. Okay, glowstone. There we go. Did I put that right dead center? Really? I couldn't have put it anywhere else. I put it dead center. Really? A stone barrel right there? Good job, Jack. There we are. All right, where's that? Let's put the stone barrel. Uh, again, we'll we'll use this later for other stuff, but for now it goes there. All right, so here we go. So we've got this. So now I'm assuming we need to get lava to this, right? Is that is that the uh, the plan? We need to get lava moved in. Um. Also, uh, make sure that's right there. All right, let's go ahead and do this. Oh yeah, oops, I forgot about that. Uh, we'll sort that out later. Um, spoilers, next Star Wars movie, one of the settings of space. What? What? That's crazy. Um, it was great meeting you at T. Uh, uh, Tuesday Night Game Fights, you were great. Host. Thank you very much, 16 Bits of Awesome. I'm, I'm really happy. That turned out turned out pretty good. I'm, I'm pretty excited how um, people's reactions have been so far for it. So that's that's good. It really does mean a lot to me that people enjoy my, my stupidness, my dumbness. All right. Let's go over here. Okay, that's in there now. This is making power. Will this go away after it ticks down? Okay, good, good, good. So now we need to get a pipe from right there out and down to here. So I need to make a bunch of those pipes. Have you filmed Sky Factory 12 yet? Yes, we have. All right, so what, what kind of pipe is this? Um, is it... Transfer pipe? Is more transfer pipe? Or is it something different than that? Fluid pipe? Is it fluid pipe? Uh, liquid. Make another setup. I mean, I could just make another... Co I mean, I could move. I could just move the cobblestone generator down. Downstairs, because that's what I'm going to need anyway, right? Just move this whole damn thing down. Uh, transfer pipes actually do work. Liquid transfer node and then transfer pipe. Okay, so let's do this. Let's move the cobblestone generator down. Let's get everything off of here and move it downwards. Um, so I'm going to break this guy. And if I break this now with stuff inside of it, will it pour everywhere or will it still be okay? Let's find out. Okay, good. So now... I'm going to put the cobblestone generator here. And I'm going to give it room for one more. So I'm going to put this thing here. Um, okay. And then we'll let this go for now. Um, let me make another uh, storage chest. Uh, crate, storage crate. Uh, I need sticks and wood. Raw wood. Do I have any raw wood? I think I have one in here. Yeah. Jungle wood. Okay. Uh, that guy. That guy. Sticks. And this. And then... Okay. So now then we've got a storage crate we'll put on top of here. On top of there. So this should be filling up. Okay, that's going to start going. Now then, um, I need to make more pipes and transfer nodes. Liquid transfer. Well, I need to get a normal transfer node. Oh, wait. Oh, I need to make a... I need to put a... I'm, a, I'm an idiot. I need a crucible. I need a crucible to make lava, and then from lava into the thing. Okay, I'm a dum-dum. I'm a dum-dum. I'm a dum-dum. All right, crucible. 
Crucible. Uh, unfired cru oh, Do I have to do this again, or can I just make a crucible? Or do I have to get clay and all that crap again? Don't break the baby. Uh, screw it. Let's just let's just pull this one. Okay. See what happens when I do this. All right. Um, did that just catch on fire? Am I an idiot and has burned my crucible in the fire? Which makes no sense because the whole damn thing holds fire. <sighs> Son of a... All right, well. That sucks. Oh, well, whatever. We'll make more. We gotta get clay now. All right, clay is... Hey, shortcut. Uh, rip crucible, yep. That's... Rest in peace, Crucible. Year 2000, whatever. Okay. Well, we got some stuff back. We got our transfer pipe. Uh, that will live there for now. Um, okay, so now... <sighs> I need to move this down, actually. Well, I can. I, I guess I can have it go over here. Okay, well, all right. Let's, let's make ourselves a new freaking Crucible, since I just torched that one here. So I gotta get clay... What you get, clay, clay is, what is clay again? It's dirt, it's dirt put into, or uh, dust put into that thing. All right. And then we do this, this, there. Uh, dust and water, thank you very much. Okay. Dust and the water. All we are is dust and the water. Uh, okay. I not do all of it. That's weird. Okay, and then we've got uh, gravel now. And then we're going to go. Uh, the diamond... Uh, Juan is the best thing on the planet, by the way. Okay. All right, that was sand. Did I get more sand than I started with? I mean, more sand. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's unfortunate right there is what that is. That's really annoying. Yep. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh I'm not vein mining. I'm not gonna vein mine. That was uh that was a dumb. Let's pull the dumb. Also my uh my iron or my diamond wand is is uh, hurting too. Stupid, stupid, stupid. If you put redstone into a into a stone barrel lobby, you can get netherrack with burn it four times ready to be crucible. Oh okay, nice. I will I will do that. Redstone dust into a stone barrel of lava. Okay. Well, I have a stone barrel downstairs, so I'll do that. Oh, God. Stupid. I'm a big dummy. Um, again, thank you everyone for coming out tonight. Um, we played some D&D earlier. Hope you were around for that. Hope you, uh, if you were, I hope you enjoyed it. We, uh, we're raising money for Extra Life. We raised a bunch of money tonight. It was super badass. Very, very proud. Um, of, of the wardens, the community. You guys are super kick-ass. Okay, there. Now. Okay. Dust. Okay, and then we hammer that down. Alright, and that just got us a bunch of dust. Alright. Now, dust in water becomes clay. Um... And where's, of course, I have a bucket of lava. And then, what do you say? Dust, what was it? Um, hey, if you build platforms with half slabs of stone in the wood, they won't spawn mobs. I did not know that. It's me being sarcastic because I totally knew that. Oh, oh, that was redstone dust. Okay. Redstone dust, not normal dust. And I don't know how much clay I need, but wait, what happened? Did, that, did I miss? All right, and then I take this over here, 
break. What? Porcelain. How do I make porcelain from clay? Uh, um, I get... Punch it. That's right. Okay, I was very confused by that. Thank you very much. There we go. Okay, now we've got clay and we get okay, I'm I'm confused. I'm confused. Uh the uh bone meal the clay balls. Okay. All right. That sounds a little familiar. There's a bone block. I, I had a bunch of bone meal, but I put it in the... You have bones in your spawner area to make porcelain clay. Okay, good, good, good. There we go. All right. Is it just this and that? Uh, I need more. I'm going to grab a couple of these blocks in here. I've compressed bone. Okay, and this goes to there. And this goes there. And uh, where'd it go? Where is my clay? Goes there. Okay, now we'll make screw. We'll make two crucibles, just because I had extra, and I'm sure we'll end up needing more anyway. Uh, where'd the other one go? There we go. All right. Oof. And redstone dust. You said redstone dust makes netherrack. How do I get redstone dust? Redstone dust. Is it essence, you mean? Like this stuff? Is that what you want? Like... Let's see, have we got anything on here? One. Man, this grows so freaking slow. Uh, just redstone? Oh, regular redstone. Okay, yeah, I, I can get, I get that. Um, he said lava and redstone. All right, well, uh, I gotta make some lava now. Um, I can do that. I just grab from here. Vampire chick SGL. Thank you very much. Brand new warden. Thank you very much, vampire chick. I appreciate you. Very happy that you're here. Thank you. And this, perfect. And then. All right, we got two nether axe to go underneath our new our new things, um, our new uh, uh, whatever they're called, the uh, lava makers. All right, so uh, we will put. Uh huh. Uh, all right, let's move this guy. Okay, so we'll make it come out this direction. So we're going to pipe it out. Um. Item block. Um, can I do it like into two? Like, um, if I do a crucible, so let's. Can it be right on top of it, or does it have to be spaced above it? Like, can I put the nether rack, um, for example, like on the floor here, or does it have to be like? Does it have to be a gap between the crucible and the nether rack, or can the nether rack, or can the nether rack sit right on top of it? Does anyone know? Anyone know off the top of their heads? One space for the fire. Okay, thank you. Glad I checked with you guys. Y'all is the best. Okay, so what we going to do? Whoa, holy crap. I ask a question, everyone. Gap, gap, gap. All right. So put that there. Another rack, another rack. And do that. Okay, so do that. And now there's a, can I place it? If I hold shift, like, all right, well, I have to light that. Um, is it just flint and steel lights it? Light that thing on fire? Is this one of these guys? Flint and iron? I have that. Yep, fire first, okay. Okay. 
Move you. Got him. Keep. I need to get a bigger backpack. I think there's a way to do it. All right. So one and two. There we go. All right. So now. Nope. That didn't do it. I'm guessing if I placed it against the... Yeah, that's how you do it. All right. I'm a dummy. Okay. Now then. Like that. There we go. All right. So now we're going to take a transfer pipe and a transfer node. One of these guys. So you will live there. And then one, two... Like that. Will I go to both of them? Look at that. Beautiful. Okay. Perfect. So lots of lava. Oh my god. Oh my god. What happened? Everything's on fire. Well, not everything, but a large portion of things are on fire. How did that happen? Ow, I'm on fire. Ow, I'm on fire. I'm spreading fire. What? What just... What happened, y'all? Okay, let's... Let's try to put out the fires. Why do I keep catching fire? Is it underneath? Oh, God. I managed to burn everything. How did that happen? What? Oh, God, come on. Oh, Jesus. How did I... How did I do this? How did I... How did I set everything on fire? Well, what we'll do... We'll do that. So, um, well... Everything is unfortunate. Everything is unfortunate. Okay. What happened? Ow. All right. So, I'm not sure. What did I hit? So, I mean, that wasn't too horrible, but Jesus, what? I'm not sure exactly what, what happened that. I lit everything on fire. Established fire break, new cobblestone floor, yeah. Um... Again, anything involving sort of lava and whatnot is definitely getting a cobblestone floor. You need to f you need cobblestone above the nether? Really? So that lit it all the way up there? Holy crap. Okay, well, there we go. All right, well, I figured that out. Now then, we've got... Let's, uh, let's keep moving. Let's just keep moving along. Let's pretend that never happened. Um, so now we're going to... We'll put... Uh, if we want to keep it compact, like run it to here, I'll put it over here. We'll put it right here. Okay, so now we need to get... No, that's not a good spot for it. Because I need two pipes. I need pipes from both of them. So let's put it here. Okay, so now um, I need to get a uh, transfer pipe. So oh, one, two, three, that into here, but I need transfer nodes. I need fluid transfer nodes. It says a lot that I'm so content with this right now that uh, I nearly lost a ton of crap, and I'm just like, eh, okay, yeah, I'll deal with it later. Like, uh, this is actually really, I mean, we're, we're moving everything around anyway, so it's not a huge deal, but that's why you keep islands separate. Like, if worse comes to worse, you just plow through one of these ledges, and then boom, you're not gonna have to worry about it. Um, just got your words to work. Midnight Maniac, thank you very much for coming out. Um, I, I burned down one of my islands. I'm working on power now. Um, and I almost, uh, just ruined everything. So, uh, was it transfer node? Transfer node. Hey, RVB fan, thank you so much. Um, thanks for coming out, RVB fan. Transfer node fluids. Transfer pipe, bucket. I need, there's two redstone, that's it. Um, can we get a highlight of that after the stream? I want to go back and watch that discovery on loop, yeah. Um, I'm sure, uh, there's probably people already who have clipped it. That was, uh... Fun times. Fun times indeed. Okay. Uh, Alright, four of those. Oh, that takes my bucket. Takes my bucket. So now, we put the transfer nodes on this guy. 
There and there. Look at it going. All right, so there we go. And we're loading up this magmatic generator. It's almost full of lava already. That's fantastic. Um, we're producing power, everybody. Okay, did Gavin get to the server? No, okay. So now we have that. So could I start making, with this power, auto hammer? Um, so can I make an auto hammer now? Or I start throwing, how quick is it? Is that producing? Um, cobblestone generator, uh, tier two. All right, take a first one. I can make, I can make a double one. Oh, let's do that. Cause we're going to start producing more. So I need, what was it? Just, how much was it? Uh, eight silver and a cobblestone generator. Yeah, let's do that. Let's, let's knock this guy out real quick. All right. Come with me. We can totally make that and start getting more because we're going to be producing a lot of stuff here pretty quick. Um, silver, I need eight silver. Uh, or iron, excuse me. Crap, was that iron or silver? Now that I said that, it was iron. Okay. Okay. And then we take our cobblestone generator. Level two. And then we're just going to drop it right there. Okay. It's going quicker now. Beautiful. And that's that's going. And we got our generator here. Look at it. It's almost max power already. Uh, rank two. What is he? Yeah, what is rank three? I probably should have checked that before. Diamond. Lots of diamond. All right. We'll work on that later. We'll get diamond later. If I put two of them side by side, will it just double it up? I guess that really won't matter. All right, um, okay, so now we've got power. So if we wanna do an auto, what do we wanna start with? We've got uh, sieve, I guess we wanna hammer first. So I need a diamond hammer, six iron ingots, and so six, seven, eight, nine, so I need 10 iron ingots, uh, 10 iron ingots, and a diamond hammer. Okay, we can, we can do that. Let's get some stuff going today. All right, um, a diamond. I have a diamond hammer. I don't know if it'll work because I have, I have a. Uh, <laughs> this is floating. Let's do this. All right, so let's do. Okay, got that. I got ten iron ingots now, so I needed two weighted pressure plates, and then auto hammer. Oh, it totally worked. It took my beat up hammer. Perfect. Okay, so now we have an auto hammer. So it needs power, but it also needs uh so how do I how do I send power to it? Okay. Um and also I need to get stone from there. So let's put it here. So how do I send power to this guy? I also need to make some hammers. Put it next to it. Can I just put it right on it? Like right next to it? What? Oh, there we go. All right, that's super easy. All right, we need... Uh, so now, we need to feed it items. Transfer node items. Okay. Um, I don't know if that'll try to feed into theirs. Well, it needs fluid, so that works out perfectly. So now, let's get... Uh, where's my pipes? Did I use all my pipes? Really? I guess I used them to make those things. All right, I need more transfer pipes. All right, pipes, 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 pipes. Um, nope. Transfer peeps. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Uh, transfer nodes. Blue pipe. There we go. All right. So I need redstone, glass, and stone slab. Uh, I got almost enough stone slab. All right, and then I need glass, which I got a lot of, god damn, I have a lot of dust. Can I make dust into sand again? Oh, oh that's compressed dust. 
I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. All right. I can't make dust into sand, I'm guessing. Um, I can just make more sand or a quick. Of course, I just broke my damn hammer. Okay. Uh, generators use output power on all sides. You can also use the energy conduits to transfer power. Okay, energy conduits. Um, I was making pipes. Uh, pipe, pipe, pipe right there. Okay, so I need redstone, glass. and I, Okay, that's what I needed the sand for. All right, so let's... I think I had a hammer in here. Let's just burn one of these guys. Oh, I got... Well, I have one glass. No hammer. No hammer. Damn it. Okay. Uh, any in there? Oh, no, that's an axe. There's this. Any hammers? Anybody got any hammers? Any extra hammers laying around? There's not going to be any in there. Okay, screw it. Uh, so we're going to make a hammer really quick. Boop, boop. And then boop, boop. Okay. Hammer. Please hammer. Do not hurt them. And do this. Gravel. Got our gravel. One, two, three, four. Okay. There, we got our sand, so let's cook up some sand, make some glaze. Um, pipes, 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 pipes. There we go. So just that and redstone. So let me grab some redstone. Uh, I'll put it back when I'm done. All right, and how many slabs do I have? How many? That's 17, okay, good. Okay. Oh, slabs. Damn it. All right. Slabs. And do that. That's 16. Oh, really? <laughs> and there's 32. We're going to need a lot of this stuff, so I don't mind making a bunch of it. And we'll get enough for another batch. One and two. All right. Oh, come on, really? All right, there we go. We got lots, lots of these, uh, lots of pipes now, a lot of piping. A lot of pipes. Okay, uh, t -t 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 uh, pipes, transfer nodes. I got one more transfer node there. That's good. Where'd I put my pipes? Where's all my pipes? There they are. Okay. Uh, do I have any diamond left? I got one diamond. I can't make a hammer out of diamond. Shift click the plus in crafting screen to make more than one of a thing. Oh, really? That's pretty cool. All right. I will, I will take advantage of that here in a little bit. All right. So now um, I've got pipes. Peeps. Um, so if I go... Come on. Nope. Don't want you in there. Okay, let's... Oh, okay. Almost broke the wrong damn thing. We'll do that, and then... Oh. Oh. And then... Boop, boop. And then... Boop. Get off there. Boop. There we are. Okay, so now... This... All right, so... Oh, look at it. It's already going. It's going slowly, but it's going. And I know there's a way you can add extra hammers in there, right? Like, could I do that? Oh, I guess, it, does it have to be diamond? Perfect. Just put the hammer on top. Auto hammer on top of the magnet. Oh, I guess I could have done that. I could do that real quick. Hang on one second. Okay, so. You guys make a lot of sense. And that's why I love you. Um, yeah, most. Okay, let's do that. Let's do that. Okay. And then auto hammer. And then uh, transfer node. And then fight. Oop. There we go. All right. There we go. That works for me. Okay, so we got an auto hammer going right there. It's making 
us some gravel. It's going slowly, but it is going. So that will make gravel. And then we can take the gravel, make it into sand, but also split this. So half will make it go to a sieve. Half will go to another uh, another generator. It's working. We're automating, y'alls. We are automating. Feed the hammer. Feed a watermelon juice. Um, oh, here. No, it's not working. It's not working. Doesn't it speed up if you feed it food? What? So... How? How do I feed it? I don't know how to feed it. It's alive! Alright, so we're getting some stuff. We're getting some automation going. This is good. That only works in compressive. Okay. I can only feed the auto sieve. Oh, okay, okay. Sieves. I can feed sieves. God, I kind of... All right, this is good. Um, and then what? What? Uh, all right, let's see here. Auto sieve. All right, so glass pane, block of iron, a lot of iron, uh, glass panes. Okay, we got. We can do that. And then it's the sieve. I'm guessing we put a mesh inside. So I need two blocks of iron, two ingots, and a lot of glass. I think we can do this. I'm gonna start making some stuff. All right, so I need uh, I need more glass. How much glass do I have? Did I did I use it all? I think I used it all. For the second one, just one. <sighs> why, why do I make so much freaking dust? I don't need all this dust. I'll I'll throw in the auto sieve here in a little bit. Um, okay, so now let's do this. Uh -huh. Okay. Where'd my gravel go? And there. Okay. Um, iron. Probably fix this floor. Um, no, well, screw it. It's probably fine, right, you guys? Snow. Oh, I have all my iron on me. Okay. Uh, all right. Almost, almost there. What is that? There's a tiny person in the auto sieve that you need to feed to speed them up. You can rename them a name, or ta uh, a name tag that someone's PC Minecraft name, a person's tiny model will appear and change that player. Oh, really? That's kind of kick-ass. Um, so I can make like a little Ryan in there if I wanted to? Or a little Gavin or whatever? Alright. Auto sieve. Alright, so I need... Uh, I, can make, I can make a sieve. I'll just make a new one. Uh, a tweet of you clip of the fire. It's amazing. Gotta be careful. The wood yeah, fire in a wood world. Um... Absolutely. That's super, super dangerous. Why didn't anyone warn me? So, two sticks of slab. Um, do this. And then I got some slabs here, so let's make... Do that. Okay, we got ourselves a sieve part. Glass pane and blocks of iron. Okay, so let's make uh, glass panes. Lots of those. Okay, I think that we have all of it now. There we go. Auto sieve. Beautiful. So now, um, if I put the auto sieve here, powered. Oh, there's a dude. Spectacular 101. So now I want to do a transfer node there in a beep. Nope. Keep. Will that work? No mesh. I need mesh. Aha! We're almost there. Let's make an iron mesh. Uh, we'll just grab one. We'll grab one from inside. But I'm making one. Um, okay. Do. Oh, 
do that, and there we go. Man, he's going slow, so I feed him. How do I feed him? Oh, there we go. Oh, look at him go. Speed boost, 4.75. Nice. Look at him going, man. Oh, look at that. He's getting stuff. Flat transfer nodes will be your friends when you get the iron. Makes block to block transfer really easy. It literally goes between two adjacent blocks. Oh, that's kind of cool. I think I saw those. Um, is these guys, right? Flat transfer nodes. So I need to get an anvil, and then I just flatten out. Oh man, it makes eight? That's pretty rad. So it makes eight, and I can just flatten it with an anvil. I can make one of those right now, as a matter of fact. Oh man, is he already he's already tired again? How do I how do I change the person inside? How do I change the skin? Oh we got a diamond! Diamond in the squoy. Go faster. Work harder. More wheat. Uh, tag. Name tag. Alright, so... Where's name tag? How do I get to name tag? Why do you play this about the crew? Because I like doing this. Got a name tag using an anvil. Oh, man. Alright. Well, that's going to be a while. Well, this is rad. So I get another... So when I put... If I put another like diamond uh, diamond hammer in here, will that slowly degrade? Like if, uh, or can I make an obsidian hammer? Engineer's hammer, Oliver hammer, stone, iron, diamond. I don't think I can make an obsidian hammer. No, doesn't look like it. Okay, mana hammer. Looks like diamond. It takes durability. Okay. Well, let's see here. If we get one more diamond... Beat up. Oh man, he's like outrunning the actual... Uh... How do I... Okay, so I gotta, I gotta speed this up with a hammer. That makes sense. I think I had one more diamond upstairs. Let me see if I did. Pretty sure, yeah, I did. Okay, perfect. Okay, so now we'll make ourselves a diamond hammer. Put that in, and do this. Now there's two of them going. All right, so that should. Oh no, he's still. We got plenty. Can I throw, can I throw, like, stuff in here? Like, if I have gravel on me, can I just... Okay, I'm not gonna vein mine, not gonna vein mine. I just wanna test this. Alright, so now... If I have gravel... Oh, that, that's cool, so I can just drop it on. Kick ass, alright. This is awesome, guys. This is really, really awesome. So now, um, so that's just pushing sand into there, or gravel into there. Oh, man. Be... That's, that's all good. This is good. Everything seems to be working. We got some auto sieving going. Um, all these, look at that. We already got tons of iron, lots of coal. This is good. Drying racks. Yes, I've known about drying racks. People will tell me about drying racks a lot. I should do that. I will do that at some point. Excellent. So uh, there we go. We got these guys going. We got uh, we have plenty of stuff happening here. Let's give them some more. Pick it up. I just, I just love this. I love that I can just sit back and watch this stuff go. Makes me really happy. Oh, I got another diamond. Beautiful. Uh, you can have the items pull out of the uh, sieve to a chest. Yes, uh, that I could probably figure out right now. Um, but right now, I'm happy with this. If I run these through compressing chests, do they turn into... I, I can do that. That's, I'm just being lazy now. Man, he's bored. These guys are taking too long. How do I speed up this process? 
Is there a, I mean, just putting another hammer in, will I do it? Or throw, uh, throw your dust in the sea. Well, that's not a bad idea. I had a bunch of dust. Let me go grab that. I'm not going to do anything with it. Where I put it? Right there. What will the stack up? Does it just do a stack to 64? Alright, let's just do that. And then put you... I can't even put it in there. So what's happening to the gravel here? Is it... Is it just disappearing because of, uh... That's interesting. So, uh, see, I thought this would have uh, it would have stayed there, but I guess it's just it's in the transfer now. Oh, it's in here. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so that's good. So that means it's not not absolutely disappearing. Crushed black cords, gunpowder, blaze powder. Can you make a blaze rod with blaze powder? Jeremy was asking about that today. Blaze essence. Blaze seeds. You run items from the auto sieve through a compressor, then right into the smeltery. Oh, that's pretty kick-ass. That'll save me a lot of time. Um, enchant the sieve mesh with more with efficiency to go faster, or looting get more drops per block. Enchant the sieve mesh. Okay, well, we're not to enchanting yet. I'm just happy to get to my first uh, auto auto <laughs> stuff here, so that makes me happy. Oh. That's what we wanted. All right. Let's go get some more melons. Make some more uh, melon juice. All right. All right. Do, do, do. Oh, my God. Look at my farm. I got a cow. I got two cows. And I got multiple sheep. I got a bunch of sheep now. That's kick ass. All right. That's what happens when I just kind of ignore things for a little bit, I guess. I also got all my... All my... Oh. All right. That falls through the world right there, folks. That would have been a huge pain. That would have been a huge pain to come back from. I'm glad I caught that. Wow. Heesh. <laughs> All right. Good times. Good times in uh, Minecraft world right there. Man, I, I panicked. All right, let's do let's do some juicing. There we go. We got lots of lots of juice. Can I make carrot juice? I totally can. I need a knife though. I don't have a knife on me. Oh, I can just do straight carrot juice. That's pretty kick ass. Uh, two Gavin moments, one night. Jack's time to sleep, man. Yeah, I, I need to go sleep. I should probably go to sleep now that this is happening. This makes me happy, though, that this is working. And um, look at it all going. I got more redstone. Got some blaze powder. Got two more diamond. I can make another hammer. Let's do that to speed up the uh, the gravel process. All right. Do that. Pull down another hammer. Uh, Dimmy X, uh, Dimmy X Mide. Not sure to say that. Thank you very much. Welcome to the Wardens. I appreciate you. Um, brand new Warden. Thank you so much. By the power of the beer, we are bonded. Super kick ass. Thank you very much. Look at that going now. We got three of them going. Boom. Lots of diamond hammers. I already got another diamond going. Oh, I made it through all of that. Beautiful. All right. Speed you up. So he already made it through all of the, uh, the, Whatever the dust I gave him. Got through all that. Beautiful. Okay. I got lots of iron ores. Um, and we'll do this just for now. Just because I have it. Um, do I not have any more transfer nodes? I guess I don't. I thought I made four. I thought I had four. Where am I missing one? One, two, three. How do I not have a transfer node? Okay, shift doesn't work on chests, by the way. I'm glad I learned that on top of something. 
That's lame. Um, do I have that? Just stone and redstone. Does it have to be actual stone like that? All right, all right. Let me grab two redstone. I'll recommend a diamond stiffened mesh to get better items. Okay. We will make that at some point, I promise. Uh, Jesus, I have so much crap. Too much crap. Uh, and then we're going to go do that. Okay. <laughs> and oh, there we go. That'll put all this stuff in there. Um, okay, it's going. It's going slowly, but it is going. Cool. All right. Well, this is good. And we'll obviously we'll change that to something else. We'll move this stuff around. Um, eventually, I'm gonna have um, I'll have sand being uh, sieved as well. Um, we'll get that diamond stiffen mesh to get better items out. Um, I got yeah, I got two fluid transfers. Screams internally. What what happened, Thorn? What's going on? Oh God, someone's sharing to check out his inventory. More nodes. Yeah, I had I had checked. I got I had tra I had the fluid transfer node, but I needed I need an item transfer node, which is that guy. All right, man, we are, uh, we're, we're cooking with, cooking with gas now. What is that, iron? I have lots of iron on me. Let's go check how our, uh, our spawner's doing. Let's see how we're looking over here. Did it get stuck? Nope, that's good. How many? We're up to five legendary loot bags. Um, that's good. Well, that's a lot of stuff here. Um, I don't know if that's working. Well, are we all... Yeah, we're just wedged. We're just caught full of stuff again. Okay, so next time we make ourselves... Uh, we're going to expand this, and we're going to make a recycle thing to get rid of all of this crap. And, um, yeah, we'll definitely do that. Um, just get rid of all... Of this. We'll just throw it out. Is there any way I can make a transfer pipe that just dumps it out into nothing? Just, like, literally spits it off the side? Oh, man. I have so much stuff. All right. Um, let's... Can I just do this? Let's go. That. Just start throwing stuff off until... Sugar, really? Oh, so much crap. So much of nothing. God, think of all of the stuff inside of there. Is there a way... I, like, there's a... a a way you can, like, grab everything of one type. I think. Oh. Think of all of the stuff that's got to be in that, that, uh, that place, man. Inside of there, it's just ridiculous. Like, it, I can't go fast enough. Can't. I want to go faster. It just stacks and stacks and stacks and stacks and stacks. This stuff never go away. If you put the zombie into a bone drawer or the void upgrade, it'll take away any excess and delete them. Zombie and bone into a drawer, the void upgrade. All right. I don't have void upgrades yet. Um, I've heard of that stuff, though. Also, a recycler apparently will um, fix this as well. Good lord. <sighs> Look at all that. That's like a tornado of death. Of just crap. Sort the items you don't want in the trash can, and then uh, and then you're fine. Can There's no trash can here, though, right? Like, I have to do this. I wish there was some way I could just... I don't know. Oh, well, we'll deal with that next time. Okay. God, I love that. All right, let's check the sieve one last time. Still love my uh, my holy ceiling here. All right, we got another diamond. Oh, good, I got everything out. Okay, so it slowly sucked everything out of there. Beautiful. That makes me happy. Starting at coal. That's going. That'll go forever. 
Sweet. Okay, let's give good buddy some more juice. Pick up the pace. All right. Um, that's gonna do it tonight. I'm gonna call it right there. We ran a little bit longer than I meant to, but hey, I can't help myself. I freaking love this game, and it's so much fun. Um, thank you very much for watching tonight. It's uh, it means the world to me that you guys would hang out and um. And uh, actually, just watch me play this game. It, it really it, it's a lot of fun, and uh, I can't help myself from doing it. I just I can't stop. I can't stop. Can't stop. Won't stop. Rockefeller Records. Um. No, I'm going. Okay, so I've got that there. I'm gonna move. Uh, I'm gonna do this. Just do that and that. This is for my trees. And then I, did I have any wood? On? I did. Oh, I have wood. Okay, I can totally. I can work on this. I can fix it. I can fix it a little bit. Fix it a little bit. Where's my wand? It's almost done. My wand is almost torched. Oh, can I get to the outside? Oh, there goes the wand. That's it. Wand's finished. Let's let's go underneath. Let's do it from from below. Can I reach up there? Totally fix this real fast. I just gotta fix this. I gotta fix this because I burned it. I burned my poor, poor. I burned it to the ground. Oh. Okay. Uh. Hop. Yep. Okay. I'm not gonna move. And almost. I get that guy right there. Got it. Nailed it. Okay. And then, ha uh ha. -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, saving. There we go. All right, just a little bit more wood. And we can do that. Let me go torch it up there so uh, baddies don't show up. Uh, the wood might burn again. Uh, shh. Shh. Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. Wood's fine. Wood is absolutely fine. You're supposed to. Supposed to leave it like this. That's what they, they tell you. So they teach you and uh Oh god, it's on fire. It's on fire. It, the wood is burning again. The wood is just burning again. Alright, so uh clearly that is not not the best idea. Not the best idea. Let me go ahead and get rid of these guys. Cause that just caught fire. Let me go ahead and uh yeah, get rid of anything above the nether rack. That's bad news. Bad news right there. The guy catch. Okay, good. Okay. Um, just to be safe, let's go ahead and knock out this guy. <laughs> I know I can use cobble, but just I would look so much better. Okay. Alright, no fire now. No fire. Man, that netherrack is hot. That is, there's no joke. Jack, please, why you do this? I have to. I have to. I have to know. Alright. This doesn't look like stopping. Kasavari, calm down. Calm down. Just calm down. Okay, here we go. We're done. We're done. We're finished. We're all, uh, we're all, all cooked. <sighs> Man, look, we got some more mob spawns over there. That's good times. All right, well, thank you so much, everyone, for tuning in. It was a little brief little bit of, uh, of Sky Factory. Cook some cobble up to make some chiseled stone. Ooh, chiseled stone. We could do that. Check your mic. It does contact noises once in a while. Okay, uh, you can put a chisel on the cobble to make different patterns. Uh, place a cobbled guard layer. Okay, all right. Um, when do streams usually start? Iridium, dynamite. I I try to start around nine p.m. Central Standard Time. Um, yeah, but it kind of changes depending on uh, on sort of what what uh like what day it is and whether or not I get up. But I do my I do my dan to start at um at nine. That's that's what I'm trying. That's what I'm aiming for now. I gotta figure out a way to make these things grow faster. All right. Anyway, um, so I try to start from nine till about midnight ish or so in Sky Factory. Um, we stream every uh, every Tuesday. We play D and D, and then every Wednesday is Warden Wednesday, where we play with the Wardens, our subscribers here on this channel. Uh, tomorrow we are starting up a Warden Sky Factory server. So we're gonna start from scratch. So you won't see any of this stuff, um, but we're gonna start from scratch. 
we're starting up a warden server where all of the wardens can play along. And um, well, maybe not all, but we're going to start with probably 16. See how the server handles. If it does okay, then maybe we'll bump it up. But it can get out of control pretty quickly. So we'll see how it's going to work. Um, apparently, um, everyone's going to start. <coughs> excuse me. Everyone's going to start on their own tree. So it's going to be everyone's going to be out in the world, kind of on their own tree, having to build out until we can eventually meet each other. So I don't know how far apart we are, but um, I love that idea. I love love that idea to uh, that we have like a multiplayer server. But you're still kind of on your own. You still have to kind of work out on your own. So it's kind of everyone's working on their own bits. And then um, eventually we, we can all meet up and then party in the middle. So um, I'm, psyched to, I'm psyched to see how it works. Um, I'm really curious. And um, yeah, I think it's going to be fun times. I think it's going to be a really, really neat thing to try. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take that. I can't stop. I can't stop. I'm just, I'm just going to juice this watermelon. Who is that? Mythical Plasma Productions. Thank you very much, Mythical Plasma Productions for becoming a warden, brand new warden. Um, thank you for that. You are super badass. All right. Um, yeah, so Christian and Kasfar have been working on the server, I think. Okay, uh, Kasfar said Christian and I spawn on the same tree during testing. So maybe we all start on the same tree. So maybe maybe I'll spawn in uh, just to knock out the first tree just so we get that first platform. Then we'll open it up to everyone because... Um, yeah, because if 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 we screw up that first tree, we literally can't do anything. Like we can't, we need we need seeds, or we need more seeds to plant and get so forth and so on. So we'll try it. All right. Um, use the melon juice to feed your sieve during uh, using a mechanical user. Oh, I have, I have been, I have been, uh, Nino, I have been feeding them. Um, I wonder if there's a way I can just like auto feed them though. Hmm, that's a whole new thing. We'll try that next time. All right, so again, thank you very much, everyone, for coming out tonight. It really does mean the world to me that you would come and hang out with me and watch me play some video games and watch us play some D&D. Um, that's really, really awesome, and we really, really do appreciate it. Oh, here's, here's Katie's cards. They need to go on her book. I'm going to put them in her book right now because I, I love her, and I am a sweet gentleman. All right. Um, this is our awesome books, our D&D books. Yeah, I'm a trial world to save me. Um, okay, so uh, again, thank you very much. If you randomly stumbled in here tonight, that really means the world to me that you're, you came and you're hanging out with us. It's really, really cool. Uh, if you could, please give us a follow. That's that's awesome. We just love uh, having you guys watch us. Um, if you're following, thank you so much. And if someday you choose to become a warden, that'd be super awesome because I love my wardens. You guys are super, super badass, and it means the world to me that you're hanging out and, uh, and watching me play this stuff. It really, really does. Everyone who threw in your Twitch Prime stuff, that's super kick-ass as well. Um yeah, so um, that is pretty much going to do it for tonight. Um, thank you very much. Goes out to my mods, Casavara, Zard, and Christian. You guys are super awesome. Thank you for keeping the chat sane. And um, again, please, now, if you're out there, please take care of yourself. Take care of each other. And let's make this planet a better place than what we started with. I love you guys so much. And uh, I hope you have yourself a lovely evening. And I'll talk to you next time uh, tomorrow night. See you tomorrow night, probably around 9-ish. All right. Love you guys. Bye. Have a nice night.